How you doing, y'all? Welcome to Nappy and Jake. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Did I sound like a witch there, yeah, bro? It was good. No more of it, though. Please. Thank you. Oh, oh it's too <laughs> creepy for you. You're yeah. getting nervous. I was getting a little nervous. I'm going to cast a spell on you. <laughs> well, uh, today we have a very special guest. Uh, some people know her as Canada, Canada girl. girl, right? Or Canada Girl 1 or 2. Two. Oh, two. two, number two. 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 Well, Canada Girl 1 wasn't really anything. Right. She, right. So, yeah. I'm the OG. No, she's actually the OG. I can't Not really. That. Actually, you're talking about the OG. Nice. Because you were talking to me first. But she fucked him first. Okay. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you're right. Oh my God. <laughs> this is also true. <laughs> so, it, it really depends whether it's like you count from talking first right. or fucking first. What do you prefer? Oh... Uh, being the second fuck? <laughs> I, think I, I think I'd rather be the second fuck. Oh. That actually is probably a good thing. That I don't know if I agree with that. I think it would, like, in the long terms of things, would you rather be a first fuck or a second fuck? I think I would rather be a second fuck. Absolutely. I guess you're right. Because, like, be if you were good fuck. enough, the first one was good enough, you might not need the second. Exactly. That's there my you go. point. Mm. Unless we go back to Do you one. think there will be a third fuck, though? Canada. That, yeah, definitely. For you, sure. What are you trying to say? You're a slut. No, I'm not. Oh, fly no, out, not. bitch. Fly out. No, <laughs> no, that's not true. Honestly, there is a the taste of maple. I will, I will say. Your pussy tastes like maple. There is, a, there is a third Canada girl. Oh. Actually, there's a fourth. Oh. Woo! There's four. Ayo. Wait, did you They're tell, did you back. ask, did you say uh, yeah. welcome to America when you came on her today? <laughs> <laughs> what did I say to you? I think I did say welcome to America about something. Did I not? No, I don't. I don't recall. It was oh. only cool the first time. It was like right. You I can't, can't do, can't it, do again. it twice. You can't do it again. Did we have any cool moments yet? Did you feel like like you're having fun? Yeah. Oh whoa! Oh, whoa that sounds whoa, like you're whoa, really whoa, excited whoa, to be whoa. here. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh, before we get into the actual, um, you know, talking of such, um, this is Pleasure Babby or Bad Baby, whatever you want to call her. Bad Baby? This bad is not ba Bad Baby. Bad Baby. That's who we have today. Canada you, version. You, catch me outside. Well, how catch about that? Catch me outside. <laughs> <laughs> uh, do you want to like, I don't know, talk about yourself for like one minute? Or like, let's make it. Usually, 10 it's an intro. Is like us doing that, right? I know, but like, I think the new thing is, is like they should introduce themselves. Okay, yeah, because we don't it. really know them. Can I have a question. Yeah. The fuck do I look? What? You could you could look at your camera. You could look at Jay. You could look at me. Yeah, I don't it's care you want about to cameras. Look. Yeah. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So you but, can look wherever but, you but want. But if you wanted to do well, you would look in cameras. If you want to do well. Yeah, right. I, We're going to grade you after. I don't do well, so I don't look <laughs> at cameras. Okay. I'm not, I, I, it, it's just awkward. I'm like, yo, I'm talking to you guys, but like, I'm looking right here. That's fucking weird for me. Yeah, yeah. I know. I need to like, look at you. But he's very good at it. I, I'm used to doing it. He it's, likes looking at himself. No. It, you can't. No. Look, mm. you're not supposed to do that though. See, it's actually bad. You really should be looking at the lens. Well, yeah, you're the, not going to look at the picture. I do it all the time. Oh my God. You're like all my girlfriends. What does that, what does that mean? That oh, when I try to film, yeah, when I try to film with them, they're always looking directly at film the screen. What? Film what? YouTube. <laughs> oh, okay. oh, all right, YouTube, uh, YouTube. <laughs> well, so I didn't know. Uh, the reason I didn't know is because last time we talked about this uh, on the podcast, he said that you had an uh, OnlyFans. We're just we're just wondering what platforms you're on. Yeah, that's why you could talk about yourself. Yeah, yeah promote Hi. it. <laughs> Go ahead. Uh, is that a secret, the OF? Did I expose you? No. Oh. God, no. You don't want to subscribe to my OF. It's quite lame. These people don't want to subscribe is what you're saying. Yes, not you in general. But maybe you almost no, no, got no. a free show. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I heard there's a little mishap. That was not. I, what I happened? First, he tells me. He comes upstairs. No, I say yo. Me. Yo, I say <laughs> then yo. Then he tells me with the microphone in my mouth. Wait, no. And then gave <laughs> me these eyes. I was like, yo, this man is like on one right now <laughs> i mean yo, i gotta do what i gotta do sometimes <laughs> <laughs> jesus christ you um, still haven't talked about yourself okay hi i'm randa pleasure mm. baby not babby don't I know what it's babby. spelled babby yeah, yeah spell it babby baby baby how do you spell baby is the h baby. silent yes 
You can't have a, a silent age. Where did word. you create that from, Bad Baby? Absolutely. Oh, you yeah. saw that. You were like, I fuck with that. Only because she's ratchet. And oh, so you're saying that you're you pleasure ratchet. <laughs> when I created this, yes. Could I change it? Probably will need to eventually change it because that's probably trademarked, but we haven't got there yet, so. Well, oh. you looked it up and you there's other pleasure babies. No, 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 Babby. no. There's Babbies. Bad Baby, which is kind of nice for my OnlyFans because when you look up Pleasure Baby, none of my photos are leaked. It's all her photos being leaked. So I'm like, we're mm. Gucci here. Oh, so you look at that to see if the people leak your shit. Absolutely. Oh, that makes Cruising sense. Cruising through. And I also have people that will like let me know and they watch out for that stuff too and then they'll report it or get it taken down, which is really nice. Oh. So you're saying like people posting it online, not on OnlyFans. They take your pictures from OnlyFans and they post it on like Reddit. Yes. Jay, Jay, Jay knows the I Reddits. Do, I do know Reddit. Specifically where the where OnlyFans pictures get like posted. It's like OnlyFans leaks on Reddit. You can get anyone's OnlyFans. You can. Should we do, I think we should look up and leak her photos. You can. I honestly don't think you could. And honestly, they're not leak worthy. What are you going to post my feet or my armpits? Oh, you only no. post feet and armpits? Pretty that's much. Whack ass only fans. Yeah, that's just yeah, boring. Don't subscribe. subscribe. Actually, don't subscribe. <laughs> yeah. That shit is garbage. I do like ass shots and titty pics and hmm. What do you and then you were like armpits and fucking feet? Armpits and feet are yet, my best sellers. And then now you're saying that you post uh, your ass and your titties, though. Yeah. So but, like, my so ass is covered. So it's, like, really, like, yeah, it's not porn. Covered? What is Literally covered? Literally, in my description, it says, I don't do porn. That means you don't put, like, your finger in your vagina. And I don't, like, suck I was trying to explain this to him. I was like, don't suck toys. I don't suck anything. I'm not going to show you what I do and how I do it. I'm going to twerk. I'm going to, like, gonna take pictures. shake my titty. Yeah, like, your classic, like, chill girl. Oh, oh, yeah, classic. chill girl. Chill girl. Classic. You're classic. Guys that chill have, girl. You guys classic. have people sliding into your DM sending you news. Those news that you got are way I have more guys. Wild. I have guys. Hey, yeah. I mean, maybe it's a sign. Maybe lean into that. Oh. Backwards. Only men? No, 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 you should. Only fans for guys? <laughs> <laughs> There's lots of guys on Only fans. You could be the chill guy on the chill, Only fans. Yeah, yeah, the classic chill guy. The classic you chill it? guy. <laughs> <laughs> classic chill guy here. <laughs> All right, well, uh, I guess that was good enough, right? Is there That's anything really else? Solid. Really... Yes, I'm on YouTube, TikTok, and Instagram. Boom. And Pleasure what do you do? Baby. What do you do though for it? I do sexology. So I talk about oh, sex sexology. education and like how to receive hmm. pleasure, how to give pleasure, how hmm. to communicate properly. Um, all intimacy things. And so what makes you an expert? Well, <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm wondering the same thing. Okay. Oh, <laughs> yo, he did hype you up before you came. Ah. He was like, yo, this girl's about to be great at sex. Oh, uh, yeah, I did. There's a whole thing. I said, yes. she's a uh, massage therapist. Yes. She's good at sex. Yes. What else did I say? She's like down to earth or something? Yeah, yeah, yeah something like that. And then what I else? There was one more thing I forgot. Me too. She's oh, I sound great. You do that on paper, but, yeah. But yeah. wait, wait. So where I do starfish. That's my go-to move. Um, yeah. Oh, in, in this in the sexology room. Yeah. So what starfish. Is starfish? Is what I I just lay there. I do Spread nothing. Spread eagle. I also don't suck dick. I, I don't think kiss. Jeffrey Dahmer's into that. If you were a guy, you know the starfish. She is a guy. I am a guy. Oh, we talked about this before. She's a little she's trans. We did say that. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> that, we, we did. We did talk about that. Wait, why do you hate him? Oh, you do, you like it to be secret. Secret. I mean, that's good because you you would come across as a woman, you know, like yeah. a, a biological one by far. I mean, right? I can tell you have like guy features. I didn't. I couldn't tell. You didn't tell. Look at her hands. Let me show see. show the hands to the camera. It's, it's always the hands. Isn't that a little weird? <laughs> <laughs> Did I make you feel small? Small as fuck. Wait, your hands are bigger than his hands? D no, uh, we did this. Dick. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Your Don't hands? do it. Let I'm me here see. letting let you see. know. Let me see. Your hands are bigger than his dick? That's a big hand. I have a really That's large a big hand. hand. It's like probably the no, size seriously, of though, when she's like touching it, I'm okay, like. Okay, but wait, okay. What do you mean by bigger than the dick? Play like, the music. I got, what? Okay, yeah, should, we, should we get into the podcast? Yes. All right. But I do want to know. Okay, go back to this. So play the music. <laughs> let me let me see. What do you mean by your hand is bigger than his dick? Like it could go all the way around the dick? I feel like that's normal. If your hand can't go around a dick. No, no, no. Honestly, honestly it's really freaky. I don't know if it can go all the way around his. Oh, Coke can. 
Yeah. Four by four. Yeah. So, That's so dude, wild. You definitely statement. have a chode. That's what it comes down to. <laughs> <laughs> I think every girl comes on, you know, that's what they're telling they me. They keep saying the same thing. They keep saying it's not that big, but thick. it is thick. <laughs> it's thick. It's thick. It is we're thick. We're not going to, why are we sitting here dissecting that? Well, you said You that literally were just roasting me. If you can't take it, then don't fucking dish it. Oh. Don't be a bitch. Damn. I love you. Yeah, I love you. <laughs> Oh, you're in love she, with him already? Oh my She's god! She's been yeah, saying yeah. that, and she also said she wanted to be a dominatrix. So I kind of like let her do her thing. You okay, but paid. I honestly do love everybody. What does that mean? You're not special. No. Yeah, hundred percent. No. No. She literally. Oh, all right. Let's talk about the lies she's, she's told. You want to get into it? Yes. Okay. Well, let's just talk about one specifically. Okay. This one bothers me. Sorry. Hold on. Wait. What lie are you gonna bring up? Damn, there's a lot. No, 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 no. There's a lot of strikes. No, 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 no. There's one that you cannot say. Okay, fuck it. But you can't use names. Why don't you say it? I've never said it. It's not even a lie, actually. It's just I left out a piece of the truth because certain things just don't need to be said. What is a lie? It's purposely leaving out No, no, no. That is a good question because there are different definitions of lying. Thank you. So what? Okay, Let's would you it, consider Lord. this a lie? Oh wait, was I supposed to say this scenario? Well, it, <laughs> yes. Deception could also not necessarily be a lie. Like mm -mm, we just talked about this. I asked her this question too. Is it? Is there such thing as manipulation if uh, you tell the truth? You can't. Oh, mm, you can't tell the truth and manipulate at the same time. That's not true. So you think you can manipulate w without lying? Yes. How so? Because. You can tell somebody a truth about somebody else, right? Mm -hmm. That makes them make a decision that you didn't necessarily need to tell them that. Like, for example, you could say, yo, this person was talking behind your back. Knowing Were they actually, though? Yes, mm -hmm. yes. Knowing okay. that they actually did. Okay. When you didn't need to do that just to cause a rift so that you could somehow gain an advantage. Absolutely. I guess. That but you're also telling them the truth. But you, you said, can, just, but but you said, can you do both? You can do both. You can manipulate and tell the truth. But okay, okay. How? All right. If you're doing it to deceit, it's not. De it, it's not. Again, it's not deception. It's just manipulation. Mm. So maybe I don't know if you did lie. No, you kind of. I still consider this a lie. Okay, no, tell me. I lie. still consider this a lie. Tell me. And the re. Okay. So we had a little bit of a fiasco where I hooked up with Canada Girl, right? One. One time. Twice. Canada won. Canada won. Yes. One time. Twice. Um, what? <laughs> <laughs> one time, one time, two twice. Times. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm just learning about this right now. Did you just do the exact same no, thing? No, yeah. How no. do you? How, how do you learn about this now? He made it he public. I knew he. I don't watch his shit. No, but he did make it public. So I made it public, and not only that, what did I do? I stopped you and said, "Hey, I gotta be honest with you right now," and told you everything about everything. Did you, I not? No, you didn't tell Wait, me. Wait, I have a question. Twice. What? Wasn't you? What, didn't you say, "Yo, I'm not gonna sleep with anybody before I came," and he said to you, "Well, I don't think that's good." Yes. So it is like he he. He wasn't hiding anything. Okay, you're going to play my side next then because if you're doing this to him, it, I get the same. I, you will. You will. If, if, <laughs> if, if, I, if I read it correctly, I, look, I'm always on the person who's getting fucked. So, <laughs> so anybody, anybody who's... Anybody, the microphone in your mouth. <laughs> anybody's getting fucked, Jay's anybody, got your back. I got your back, <laughs> basically. Basically. So, okay, explain, explain the story. Okay, so... Okay, but yeah, this is my, this is my point is that I've been very honest with you. Like extreme, to the point where it could have hurt me a lot. And I've been extremely honest about who I am to you. Even though I knew that saying the honest things might hurt my reputation with you. Let's just put it that way. But then you turned around Your and to fuck. you didn't say anything. Yes, you didn't say anything <laughs> Absolutely. to me about people you were sleeping with. You just kept it to yourself, which was fine. I didn't ask, I didn't ask. And then there was one night where you made a comment and then I was like, oh, so like when was like who was the last person you slept with? Or something like that. I think I don't know if I asked the question or you just generally kind of brought it up. I think you made it a joke up to kind of get me to ask you. That's how I felt it. It came manipulation, as I would say. And so I asked you about it, and then you said, Oh, you know, I just slept with this one guy, you know, like six days ago. 
And I was like, interesting timeline. I slept with Canada Girl seven days ago. And I posted that video seven days ago. So you're saying retaliation. Retaliation, but it came out when she got here seven days after find out, telling me a story, telling me a story, slips up and is like, oh, actually, you know, the last time I hooked up with somebody, I actually hooked up with two people in the same day. No, it wasn't the same day. It was, Ooh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Bang, bang. That's wild. That's fun. It wasn't, okay. In my defense, it wasn't in the same. 24 hours. They were technically both two different days. Okay, on different days. So one was at uh, 11 p.m. The other was at 1 a.m. No, one was a little bit more morning time. Okay. So like 4 a.m. Six hours to eight hours later. Yes, we'll go with that. Okay, what was, uh, like, you were just living your best life? Were you, like, <laughs> what, what was happening? She's like, so how did it happen? Yeah. Um. Okay. What was happening? Um, well, you don't remember. Uh, yeah. It took a long. Didn't... It was that long ago. No. Okay. So here's the thing. Here's my fucking issue with men and just in general. Um, oh. Or just people in general. It's they interesting don't... how we're having an issue with men when we lied about things. This is Wait, a very, is that a very lie, woman though? thing Wait, to what, do. What, what? What exactly? I have a question though. I want to go back. Let's go back to if it was Thank a lie you. or not. She told you that she fucked somebody. Yep. Because you asked her, did you fuck somebody? She mm -hmm. said yes. At the time that he asked you that question, had you fucked the second person? Of course. This is my point, is that I don't yes, you have. fucking remember. Wait, wait, wait. wait oh, wait. Whoa, yes, what? definitely. Wait, of how course. many days ago? It was six days after. Oh, and if you fucked him six hours after, yes, I definitely it's clearly within the range. Definitely. So you just felt weird to tell him, yo, I fucked some two guys. Probably. Like, no. why didn't you tell him? If he asked mm. you... Okay, so this is how my brain works. And you'll never believe me because nobody ever fucking believes me when I say this, but I'm I wonder actually... if there's a reason for that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder why. Like, hey, you know how it's normal for people to like think things through before they do them? Lots of people aren't really impulsive, but, and people usually I tend think to it's think... it's the opposite. But... Yeah, I think more people are impulsive. Yeah, yeah. And but they don't how think. impulsive? Do you know what you're doing before you're doing it? Or do you reflect? It's like you took a whole bunch of Molly and then you went out and you did a bunch of fucked up shit and you're like, oh, I didn't really think any of that through. Well, I think a lot of people on drugs do do that. Yes. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's true. Were you on drugs? No, I was sober. Oh, so you're sense. saying that your sober life is your drug life. So you're pretty much on a Molly every day. You could say that the ADHD yeah. is fucking wild. So, okay, explain what <laughs> happened. Explain what happened and why you didn't tell him that it was two guys. I just didn't even think about it. Oh, you I didn't even remember? Didn't even no, I didn't it. think about. Couldn't even think about it. In the it, didn't, like, it didn't. It slipped it your mind. It didn't come even through. The last yeah, person well, I slept that with. Saying, that could like, be true if, actually, if it's normal for her. Definitely. Ask my mom. Ask my sister. My dad. Every, <laughs> everybody. Everybody is like, yes. Miranda is like all over the place. Oh the no! Time. I meant, is it normal to like just like sleep, sleep with, with multiple, multiple guys oh, within shit. eight hours? No, 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 oh, no, 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 no. That's not a normal thing. I'm not gonna lie. I did feel quite bad for both of them. I mean, I didn't feel bad for being the second like, one. Would be in that case, the se being the second fuck is not the good thing. No, no, no. I no. don't know. I don't think I would care. Oh, now you're game for you, second. You've fuck. done that before, right? No. You fucked a girl after you said that, like there was like some she was eating ass and maybe and you. Fu that was a while back. I don't remember. I that. remember that. It was I don't your remember ex. that. She came over. You fucked her after she she fucked some other guy. The day before or like that night. Yeah, maybe it was the day before or something. But that's okay. That's what I'm saying. Maybe I think the reason you go to number two that quickly is probably because number one didn't do the job. Absolutely. Is that what happened? Yeah. That's what happens. And which is strange because that first one should have been fucking wild. That was the first time I've never come with him. Mm. Came. Tough. Came. No, it's come is good. So what? So you were just like you had sex with them, and you were like, "This is not good. I need to have sex with somebody else." Yeah, I need a fucking orgasm. It's good to know. That makes sense. Didn't have it the second time either. So oh. just to let you know, I so ended just, up fucking myself. Was it guys? Wow. Was it was it guys that you just Went normally for, fuck? Or are they yes. like okay, okay? So it's in your rotation. Yes, yep. I don't like expanding my roster anymore. It, you have to be very special for me. How to How many open people up. are in it? Is a starting lineup? In my roster? Yeah. No, probably only two, but I think I just lost both of them. Oh. From why? Why? What? Don't look at me. Why did you lose them? 
How did Because now that? they both know that I'm sleeping obviously with somebody else. So when I get home, oh, you did. I'm gonna have to find a new roster. Looking for another one. <laughs> oh shit! Looking for well, a victim. Well, <clears throat> I gotta do the same thing. It's worse for me. No, I talked about this. It's worse for me. Yeah, you cried about it. I literally you, told her. You cried? I was like, no, I didn't no. cry physically. Chris has literally been on an emotional roller coaster this whole time I've been here. I don't know what I'm getting. I, I, no, you know what? I, I think you have been sad, bro. You've been on some weird shit. Yes. I have been. That drug? Why, what is it even the purpose of you taking that shit? For oh, my no. 30th birthday picture where everyone's going to see how jacked I am and this be like, oh wild. my God, like I did a glow up in like so however many months. Like, do you see how jacked I am now? Yeah, you fucking cheated. Bro, I feel Trend. like you've always been jacked. I don't know what you're That's talking what about. That's what I said to my friends, too. I was like, I don't understand why oh he's God. doing this. He already looks great. He wants to look better, bro. I see it. I, it, it You look sad right now. I'm emotional. It, this this is causing me to be emotional. Do your nipples hurt? I <laughs> feel them. <like. laughs> Where's your cotton cork? I, I don't know what to say anymore. <laughs> I really I don't know what to say. I know I have been sad. I don't have. I don't have been sad. I've definitely been way moody though. My but mood's been insane by the hour. So Hourly. why do people do this shit? This shit makes it's no sense. Up. People do it usually when they're going into a competition. I work I in am. a huge steroid place, so like I knew what he was running. I know like shit. Mm -hmm. I know way more than the average female would know, unless they are in the bodybuilding community. Then they might know more than me too. But do you? Are you gonna be glad when you get off of it? Hundred oh, percent. Yeah, for sure. Hundred percent. You're like fuck. I thought I'm, it was I'm supposed waiting to, down the day. I thought it was supposed to like, like be okay after and level out after a while. It ain't leveling out, it's, honey. It's <laughs> leveling, but it's it's staying at oh, a level. What's happening? What's happening in this household? The past couple of days, you look at and fucking like some crazy shit has happened. No, no, no. <laughs> it honestly kind of has. What? <laughs> yeah, it's what? Been fucking insane. And the thing is, like, I'm so chill, and then he's like acting like it needs to be more of an emotional big deal. And I'm like, it's not. Okay, like, let's really start not. from the beginning. Oh my God. So <laughs> when did you find out that she had sex with two guys? When she got here. She was just like, yo, just Already so you know, showed up. I was like, maybe this would have changed my decision. Is this why you texted me? Because she slept with two guys? No. I don't know if I can do this anymore. Do That's what? what? he was thinking. Oh yeah. Oh, okay. oh yeah. 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 But okay. Wait. What happened? Let, let's let's start from the beginning. Okay. Let's give a nice timeline. I'll start with my questions. Tangents. Okay. 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 You go first. Wait. Wait. Are you what? asking about the first? What happened with me this past week? Uh, no. 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 <laughs> <laughs> you really want to know? <laughs> <laughs> Just been working. <laughs> okay. Um. I don't. You know. So okay. Yes. That there was a lot of. I got a little freaked out. Because you know me, I don't do good with lying. That's like my number one red flag. And so you felt like she lied. Multiple times. Okay. <sighs> Multiple times. The number one lie was the first of all, her sleeping with two guys instead of one. No, that was the second worst one. Okay, are we actually going to consider that a fucking lie? Absolutely. Well, I don't know if, again, I don't really know. Time out. I don't, I don't here's, know Here's the bullshit. a lie. Here's the bullshit behind it though. I, out of nowhere, without you even asking, I came and told you about hooker girl. I told you about 22. I told you about every fucking thing and every detail of what happened to me, what was going on, opened up to you about everything. You didn't say anything back to me. You didn't tell me what was going on in your life. You just said, I appreciate you for telling me that. And I said, yeah, you know, cause I'm a fucking real ass. I might be a douche and I might fuck up and I might make mistakes, but I'm always real as fuck. And I told you that. And what's upsetting is that I opened up to you that way, and the fact that you couldn't even tell me the full truth about your life is bullshit. Well, okay, Chris, here, let me tell you. I'm just going to educate you here. This is oh, what I do. I this is what I, I do to my, on, my um, subscribers, out. okay? <laughs> so there are three things you need to be aware of when you are bringing up an intense conversation. This is an education Your class. timing. Hold on, can I write this down? Your yeah. timing, your turf, and your tone. Where was I Damn, when you decided dude, she to just came out with three things. It's like, what the fuck? Did you have that in your fucking know. head? I didn't no, have timing um, or turf or... Or tone. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'll say you. your tone was in check. Your timing, terrible. I was literally listening to my baby cousins run around the house because we were about to have a family dinner in about five minutes, okay? Wait, wait, what do you mean? I was like, at a family dinner when he FaceTimed me. Oh, this was the day before you came that you told him? No. No, 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 no. I told her this, what, 
At the least Sunday. six, seven days. Yeah, before. It was Sunday. So Oh, oh, you, you telling her about everybody. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. So I he told me on Sunday and then I came out on Friday. So it's a good amount of time. Yes. So here's where you could uh. are you in a space to receive something? I like oh, this? I could receive anything right now. No, what that's what I'm saying. You should have asked me. Are you oh, in a space wow. to receive something like this? This is some right girl now? shit. Bro. I like women. No, it's called you're being mindful of I'm not what, good with this. Yeah. Because you want to, like, your turf. Where are you right now? I and don't ask somebody, yo, are you cool with receiving this message that I'm about <laughs> to deliver to you? They're I understand gonna, that people are like that, but it's just not me. Okay, but time out. Aren't they going to be like, tell me right now? No. Who, like, who de- every single person when you're like, I want to tell you something, but I can't tell you right What? No, just tell me right now. That is just true. Tell me right no, now. I don't want to know right now. I don't want to know specifically because that, having that conversation, I was fine with it landing in my body. It was your energy oh. after where I was like, oh, this is fucking weird. So then I came out of the room and my mom's like, what's up? What's going on? Like, why are you not out? And I was like, oh, I just had a really interesting conversation. And then I told my mom, like all the things that you told me, and she's like, well, like, are you planning on dating this guy? I was like, not, no, I don't think so. Like, Damn, she, why did you make that face like that? You were taken aback by her saying that she's not planning on dating you? I'm not going to say anything to that. I'm going to leave that comment and that statement open. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay. I like uncertainty. Okay. Hard gulp on my side over here. Good. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Are you um, being hopeful? No, okay. Oh, okay. Wait, what? She, she told her mom six days or seven days ago, or even longer, but at this point. Yeah. She told that her mom she said, that no. She's like, nah, I'm not going to fucking just try this Another girl just trying to use me as a piece of meat and lie to me. That's the truth. This no, is classic. No. Literally classic. I said, I'm, I, a piece of, I'm just a piece of garbage. Just throw stuff at me. Actually. She you wants know, the dick, bro. That's the it. chode. The chode, bro. The know? chode gets them all. Okay, wait, do you know when you're going to date somebody? <laughs> uh, no, no, you just like hit it off. And I know in my mind, I'm very like, I can be logical. Oh, so when, you were leaving in the door so, open. But you, you, cause you told your mom, no. Yes. That's I interesting. said, I don't know. No, oh. I don't know. No. So it was like leaning on the no side, but you're still in the middle. I'm in the middle because one, like Chris had brought up before distance. And then also prior to this, like a couple weeks where he was started running trend and he started acting like more just different and not understanding if that was actually his personality or if that's like a drug interaction that's happening physiologically in the body. Um, so yeah, I didn't know. And I didn't know like coming here. I'm like, are, cause my girl, other girlfriend who flew out to Montreal to meet this guy, she showed up and it went like, they weren't compatible at all. Mm-hmm. So it's like, how can I know if I can date you or your potential dating candidate without knowing how our energy meets when we're together. Okay, so you were a little thrown off at the time that he told you, look, this is what's happening in my life. I've seen all these girls. You were a little thrown off by that. A little bit. I wasn't expecting it. I didn't know, understand why I needed to know. So was that the day that you slept with two guys? No, I didn't sleep with anybody after. Like, no, I hadn't slept with anybody. How long hadn't I slept with anybody for? No, the the time, I will... Because the thing is, I posted the video about Canada Girl, and then we obviously, you made some comments to me about it. What were the my, comments? I thought my comments just, were funny. Just little shit. I like Just shots. little shit. Like what? Like just like little jabs, like, you know what I mean? Like in text. I don't okay. really know. I, I can't like yeah, yeah, off the yeah, top yeah, of my yeah. head remember. You know what I mean? It's like, oh, how, like, how are you doing today? He's like, I don't know. Ask your other girl. You know, shit oh, yeah, like that. Okay, no, I did not. You know what I'm not, talking about. No, 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 no. You okay, just give me an example. That- Bitch, you fucking give me an example. Oh. Oh. Look up O Canada, because that's what I call her. Oh my god. O see, Canada. See, she has a nickname. My oh, and we got I O Canada, my... Rave Babe. That's what I call the other one. Rave Babe. Yeah, Rave Babe. Rave and then babe. what do you call the um hooker? <laughs> what did I call her? I called her something. I came hooker? up with a name. No, I... no, no, no. Oh. I came up with an actual name. I like doing that. Okay. You're good with naming like girls he's fucking. Yeah, or anybody. Or like girls that he's like talking to. Yeah. That makes sense. So, so, okay. I don't understand though what the effect of him telling you all that information was. Threw threw me off in a sense. Like I'm fine with him telling me that stuff, but I needed to be in a mindset where I could connect with my family. And so like after hearing that, I'm processing. How do you say it in here? Processing. 
processing. I'm processing. Oh, <laughs> processing. Wait, how do you say it? Processing. She says processing? She's processing. processing. I'm processing. Can you say sorry real quick? Sorry. Sorry? Oh, sorry. she does it right, though. You don't do it like fucking Canadians right, do it. What do you call when you're like holding something and you know that thing that's around items that you're walking around? The bag? The bag. Yeah, the bag. The bag? You got the bag? You got the bag? <laughs> Why do I sound like that? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so wait, anyways, where were you? So you were you were in you were with your family, and it was hard for you to process that information. Sorry, the turf. I, I didn't I didn't know the turf thing. Timing, Next time I'm gonna timing turf and tone. You realize your tone is really good though. Like you deal with things very well, and like you're very well spoken. You're very honest and mature about it. So that's Thank really you. good. So you got Thank check you. mark on that one. There you go. Check. Your ter your turf and tone or turf and timing. Yes. Well, let me ask you this because I've just experienced this with every woman in my life. Is there ever a good time? Yes. No, no there's not. Because yeah. the, you know, if, if it wasn't that day, it would have been the next day. Oh, I was petting my cat and I was emotional <laughs> that day. I had my period. It was six o'clock. I just ate a bagel. Did you just categorize me in a category with all other women? Because I'm pretty sure we've established I'm quite different. Yeah, you got manly features. I was raised by men. You could tell. <laughs> oh shit <laughs> okay sorry better timing next time not so what what happened though what was the fallout from that conversation i don't think there was any. i don't think there was no then that, that's not even a big deal so that didn't even have any effect on anything no yeah so why'd you lie to me that's still the question Th yeah okay that that's what it goes back to <laughs> yeah. it was like, like I, why can't we just be real I, I don't understand that situation is that like did you feel a little weird telling him yo i fucked two guys definitely and then why'd you end up telling him anyways? If you were if you weren't gonna tell Oopsies. him in the, the beginning, why'd you tell him it later? Slipped out. How it did slipped it out. how did it slip out? You know what? Honestly, I don't even know. I don't mm. even know. I don't that's the thing. Like I don't I don't People mm. think that I will have this mischievous plan. Like you did this on purpose or you implanted this oh, on purpose. Oh, we don't say I don't think, no, no, we're just calling or, you a liar. No, no, no. I'm oh. just wondering I'm I'm very can, just confused how it even came out. What what, what was, was the, con the conversation? I See, I don't know. remember stuff like this either. Well, I don't know. I don't remember either. We were sitting on my couch, and you were just like, and "Oh, I." You know what it guys. is? I think I was egging you on a little bit. I think this is what it is. The reason you told me the truth, and I feel like this is when w women tell the truth, is if you if you start fucking with them a little too hard, they try to give you a jab that you did. They hold on to it until the time is right. And I think I was fucking with you on the couch. I was talking shit to you. And then, you know, I mean, I probably, maybe I was talking about the girls I was fucking. Yes, that's so what now, it was. Now they that's, have to one They're up. like, oh, well, well I well, fucked two guys he, in fucking 12 hours. Yes, Fuck yes. you, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> they love that. <laughs> they hold on to it so that when you're yes. talking shit, they have something in the holster. That might be true for the average, but no. Okay. So I'm, you just I would literally be sitting. I have nothing to fucking hide. Besides fucking two guys. No, it's out. And okay, let's talk about more then. Let's, let, how about this? This will lead into your conversation yes. with Jay. But the biggest lie of all was that you are vegan. I am not vegan. Oh, fuck. No. Here's, here's what's wild. <laughs> <laughs> I, okay, wait. Hold on. I am a flexitarian. No. What the See, fuck is a flexitarian? This is where it was bullshit. And, I, and that's what I'm trying to say. She, she made it sound, made it sound like, like I've been a vegan for years. Okay, but and did she it, tell you that she ate meat? She How said, she, I'm a flexitarian. I said, yo, tell me what your typical normal diet is. She said, well, I eat everything. I'm a flexitarian. I just, Oh, so you know, she did say that I over eat, the phone. She said, yeah, over FaceTime. the phone. She said, yeah, you know, I eat meat. Just, you know, sometimes I, you know, have vegetarian. Turns out she gets here. I whip out some meat. She's like, oh, I don't. Maybe she's just on this right now. Yes, exactly. Because no, no, I just got my nutritional no. plan, and then I literally showed him. The, I showed him the date of the email, which for, was what two weeks ago. No, it wasn't. Let me see. I got to take my phone out. How? how just tell us the truth. How long was the email ago? I don't know, Nicole. How long ago did you send me that diet no. plan? She doesn't remember a lot. You have memory issues, huh? Yeah. Mm. So <laughs> I kidding. I kidding. I kidding. I kidding. My point is, you got a damn Fact vegan so. meal plan. 
So meaning my that coach I said, is, what do you eat day to day? You said, I eat everything. No, you don't eat everything. You literally have no meat on your plan. Well, right now. Thank you. No. Uh, because I, no. you made it sound. Okay. This is, this is, you made it sound like she's a hardcore vegan. Like, she is. For years now. I just ate Chick-fil-A and I had pieces of your fucking chicken just right now. I have stacks of tofu in That's my fridge. That's not a real to uh, vegan, bro. No, she's that bullshit. what I fucking say. Okay, what? Because I take vegan protein powder because my body can't digest whey? Listen, it's not, no, it's not the pro, it's the protein powder. It's the tofu in my fridge. It's the constant. You were getting. You got vegetation. really upset. I think that this is what honestly put him over the edge the first day. Because mm. I get a message. He's like, "Bro, I don't know about this." And then I was like, "Why? What's up?" And he's like, "Oh, there's little things like she lied about being a vegan." <laughs> <laughs> I was like, "Shit, bro!" Yet I just posted on my story me crushing fucking Chick Fil A and also eating sushi. Okay. But I'm what are you vegan? talking about? But okay. I'm You're vegan. so confused right okay. now. But I'm vegan. The first fucking day, it was a whole fiasco. Why? What happened? Because I was just trying to enjoy some meat. And I said, what do you want? And I found out that mostly you were not going to eat meat. Because I just got my nutritional plan. No, that's bullshit. I just got w my plan. Within weeks. With, you could have told me. I asked you what your day to day was. You already had your plan. That's bullshit. I didn't have my plan already. I literally just got it the week that I was coming here. I that did was it. Okay. My first week on the plan. My point is, is so I think obviously that I don't want to fuck up my first week on my plan. It, okay, time I out. I did. Yeah. Nicole's right. going to be upset with me. No, but. she's not. I'll tell you why. Because A, we're still eating good. But two, this is, no, this is what I'm talking about. It was just like the first one where you like gave me like the half truth. You made it seem to me like, you know, you're just like, you know, you eat whatever, but you don't really eat whatever. What is a flexitarian? I've never heard of that term. Okay, so for me personally, I like if I go to the grocery store, I'm not gonna go out of my way. So okay, wait, hold on. This is why this happened. Mm. This is why this happened. So when I went through my breakup, I wasn't eating at, at all. I dropped 20 pounds. So oh, at all, you were I on was a fast. I was just straight mm. up crushing protein shakes to not go catabolic. And <laughs> seriously, oh, shit. yeah, I was just, that's all I was eating. And then when I started to bring back meat into my diet, it started to cause inflammation in my body, which it did probably three or four years ago, which is why I went vegan for almost two years to get my inflammation in my blood to come back down. Mm. So it's like, you know what? Fuck this. I need to find something that I actually will eat, not just have go bad in my fridge. So then mm. I ended up making a new friend. Now she's one of my best friends mm. and she's vegan. So I was like, you know what? I don't know my Classic. protein intake to have for a vegan. I was just fucking going whatever way when I was eating vegan. So can you make me something where I can have like a structured plan and I don't have to think about it? So you said to her, hey, I'm vegan. Can you please make me a vegan plan? Or I want to I'm, be vegan. I'm willing, no, I'm willing to try to see if I can make myself eat again. Cause I needed to eat cause I was getting really sick. This is sick. pretty sad, bro. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Wow. See, do you she feel She was like just trying to eat. I was literally just trying, <laughs> I was trying to build a healthy relationship with you. How the fuck did it turn into this? Because you never asked me about the background on why I turned vegan. And I'm why not even I fucking vegan. You're a flexitarian. Thank you. I still don't know what the fuck that okay, means. Okay, flexitarian bro. means so like if my, my mom's an amazing cook, my sister is also an amazing cook, my dad is too. Their like specialties are obviously meat dishes. Yeah. So I'm not gonna go over there because when I was vegan last time, I missed out on so many fun opportunities and I'm a huge foodie. Like fucking love me some food. Yeah. yeah. Um so like, I like food too, I'm, not gonna, I'm not gonna <laughs> <laughs> I'm not I'm not going to be like, no mom, I'm can you just make me veggies? I'm like, no, I wanna eat that. That looks really fucking good. So I will eat it when I want to. Am so I gonna go? Pleaser. Am I it sounds a little bit no, you're a people pleaser. I'm going to go to I'm not gonna go to the grocery store and be like yeah i want to buy that raw chicken right now that just doesn't sound appealing to me because like yeah. i can't i was having issues with consuming food in general right so let me ask you this so that I ask, does sound very vegan like though to be honest a little bit because you're very, like you're vegan. like yo but if i go to a restaurant i go to your place anyone else's place and you're cooking meat i'll eat it my point is why do you have to hide yourself to me i i I know. Why, what, what made you think I got to like, you know, make it seem like I okay, eat more the one, meat than I do? The one question I did ask, well, because I thought you were a full on vegan. I didn't, this is not real vegan. Bro. No, no, no. She's, no. she's a fraud. Yeah. Yes. In, in multiple ways. Definitely. Fuck. But bro. I said, damn, <laughs> I said, damn, that's mad weird. She didn't tell you she's vegan. How does she sketch about that? But not that she has an OnlyFans. <laughs> 
I was just wondering. That's where I drew the line. The veganism was it. And the that's only why, fans were good. Well, I, but now, <laughs> that's why I didn't understand. I was like, I mean, you would think that you were like very open and honest, right? Yes. And then I was like, that's such a weird thing to not tell somebody. Yeah. Maybe. There's certain things. Were you maybe. nervous that he wouldn't like you if you were vegan? That's what I'm No, I literally straight up told him on the phone. I was like, I'm flexitarian. Because he asked me, what are you eating? I was like, what was I eating? I was eating tofu. Oh, so you else. just didn't pick up on the context clues that she was no. vegan. No, I He asked, also talks I a asked, fucking lot. And I talk a lot. And Chris talks a lot. There's multiple conversations where I think maybe I did in total of four hours, 10 minutes of talking. No what? way. What? This is see. This is insanity. Ten minutes. That's that means three hours and fifty minutes of me talking. What do you talk about? Lots. That's that's <laughs> bullshit. I, think about right now the conversation we're having. This is normal amount for both of us. You you make it sound like I'm sitting here just blabbering for four hours and you're just sitting here like oh fuck this guy. No. Yeah, like I'm gonna hear like, the lies if you're not talking. I love listening to you talk, or I wouldn't listen. Okay. No, no, no. See, now you're trying. Sweet. No. no, see, no, no. this is these are some tactics. This is the game. Manipulation. This is the game. This is the bullshit that she plays. Okay. I just want to say, I just want something real, Let right? Me stroke your ego. No, see, that's mm, this is my point. Just be yourself. Just be that's, who you yeah, are. Yeah. Did you not feel like you could be yourself by being vegan? Were you like, this guy eats too much meat? I can't tell him I'm vegan. Exactly. I literally I only have been with bodybuilders. So did you tell them? What do you mean? I was eating meat. Did at the you time. ever? Do you have like some trauma? Like in the past, did some of you date that was a bodybuilder Absolutely. be like, "Yo, fuck you for eating vegan"? <laughs> no, <laughs> nobody's ever said that. Fuck you, you vegan. And I'm not even vegan. I'm not even. Yo, I don't fuck any, with that shit. Any people who are vegan watching this, like right now, not would be like, nobody. "Nah, man, she's not fucking vegan." Yeah, no, I, that's what I said. I don't yeah, believe you're that not. you're a real vegan. No, you're and not. I drink non-vegan alcohol. I drink frick. I there's. Oh, so I heard about that recently. This is not. I didn't know that vegan had like you couldn't drink wine as a vegan. I was like, yo, I didn't know this they shit. They make vegan wines, but yeah. I don't know what the like. Where does the meat come in to a wine? That's making? what I don't know. It's probably gonna be like the oil or the no. Cheese. I think it's the I think it's like the what? Why is there cheese <laughs> in the wine? No, I think it's the feet. The feet, you know, like oh, the feet, the mushing of the grapes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's like the skin on your feet come off. In, uh, into or the is it the barrels like that they marrow. age it in? Do they like coat it in fat? Maybe. But then wouldn't there be fat on- I don't really know what the fuck, how they make wine. I think they make it up. Yeah, they yeah, just probably. say- Yeah, probably. That sounds like, like that's shit. like everything. Like, like, yeah. like their, your shampoo is gluten-free. Like what? Why did that need you to be said? You gotta add that on there. It's organic maybe I too. think the best dude, thing- it's, <laughs> Dude, Indian food is always so funny because they'll like say like things are gluten-free when like they would, it's normally would be gluten-free. Like rice? Yeah, 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 yeah. Like yeah, rice, yeah. I'm like, okay, hey, but wait, what? <laughs> yeah, yeah, there's no reason to add that. It's just marketing. This is marketing. We talked, we, I, oh, I had a protein bar in my cabinet. Remember? It was the, it was a woman protein bar. It's a oh, woman? Yeah. It's for women? It's, it was, it was made by women for, for women. women. But the, and I looked, looked at the, the things and I was like, what makes this for women? I was like, is there like a type of hormone, a type of vitamin? Ch there's no, nothing. No. You're taking it's estrogen. Just, it's just marketing. It's just, I, I'm a woman. I made it. And it's now like razor women. Razor. The razor. Men company, razors are so much yeah, better. It's crazy. It makes no sense. You would think that women razors would be better because they're shaving their fucking whole bodies. I think there was one more lie. I don't remember which one it was. I don't consider the vegan thing a lie, and I don't consider the other one oh. a lie either. That one, honestly, if you were gonna honestly, if you were gonna these both are in the gray areas of lies. They're not necessarily hardcore lies. It's not because like I you said never asked her straight up, "Are you vegan?" No, no, I asked her, I said, tell me what your day-to-day -day is. Once I was here. No. Once I, I, asked, I was here. I remember asking that specifically over the phone. And what did she say? She said, I'm a flex. She responded back to the that comment with the flexitarian thing. Well, based on what she's describing, it is flexitarian-ish. But that's what I'm saying. Flexitarian meaning like one of my meals a week can be meat. Not, oh, every day I'm eating meat. Jay, can you Google flexitarian? <laughs> This is this is insane. What do you mean? What did you think a flexitarian meant? I thought it meant, you know, that she's gonna eat. You meat. eat whatever. Yeah, exactly. Literally, what is a flex? That is what it is. It's just a regular eater. Regular. Meat. Yeah, I'm a flexitarian. The simplest definition of flexitarian diet is a combination of flexible and vegetarian. Yeah. So vegetarian is a huge chunk of it, though. It's but like it is. So it's not vegan, though, is it? I mean, you eat cheese. Yes. Nope. 
Where's the I cheese? I eat cheese, but I'm lactose and I didn't bring my lactose pills. Oh, interesting. So you're lactose, but you eat cheese. They make lactose free cheese. I have never seen you eat cheese and or milk in his house. I ate fucking, I drank Do you like milk. ice cream? She likes ice cream. How is she a vegan? Okay. Like sprinkle cones? Oh my God. Dipped in chocolate? Chocolate has milk well, in it. See, it's like saying things, but do you eat it? Have I not ate chocolate since I've been here? Do you eat ice cream? I can't because I don't have my lactose pills with me. Do you want me to fucking rainbow fucking your bowl? I think so. Hmm. He's into that. I am into that though. He, not in the bowl though, on his chest. Oh, Cleveland steamer. Mm. Mm. I did eat your ass. You've done lots of stuff to my ass. What else have you done? <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I don't know. You put it in? No. Look at that. Yeah. Eye. You did. You did. Look at that. The eye. big A. The big A. We had the big A. It was honestly, it's been a while. It was, it was much needed. But I did, okay, there was a sus moment. Do you remember? What? You don't remember. Well, you won't think of it as a sus moment, but I do. She, you funny. farted. No. She queefed. Not that. No. Remember? Even if I did, who the fuck cares? Sex well, is he, th again, he just said to you that you might not find it weird, but maybe he oh. would. Oh, no. I, I don't think I found it weird, but it was it was a funny comment. I so. Oh, yeah. We, I, <laughs> we laughed at it. Yeah. <laughs> yes, that was, no. We were laughing during it. Oh, I like that sometimes. So, yeah, so do I. No, it was. It was fun. But sometimes it's like I can't. I can't do anything after that, usually, after the it's, laugh. It took me a second to keep going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but What was the laugh? So yeah, what was that? I don't remember. I do. We, we, I, flipped, I flipped you over. We went to, like, missionary. Wait, didn't you ask what hole it was? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I put it in. I was like, which one am I in right now? <laughs> and then I said, wait, isn't that a good thing? <laughs> I was like, no, no. Because, like, it was confusing. Because, like, she's like, wouldn't you know it's my ass? Did I say that? It was something more like, no, okay. No, 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 I wouldn't have said that. No, no, I, okay. No, I said, isn't that a good thing? And I was like, not really. Why not, Why? though? Let's, let's talk this because through. Would it not be a good thing or would no, it be a good thing? No, that is a bad thing. Because I feel like if you're putting it in somebody's ass, you, you should, should know. Not be put, no, you should not be putting it back in the other hole. Well, true, but the other aspect is your asshole should be tighter. Your fucking dick is like the size of a Coke can. So you already stretched my Dan, booty you out. You really do have a big dick. No, bro. this is no, bullshit. No, you always no. be lying to me. No, I, that's not true. Don't no. This is about your asshole. It is not about my dick. You already stretched it out. What does the sphincter muscle do? I do think that that is honestly true too, though. The the asshole once you, once it's there, you can go back in easily. Yes, absolutely. You think it's all like when you take it out fully. <laughs> It doesn't close up that quickly. No. Especially if you were fucking her for a while in the ass before. Yeah. Yeah, I guess it was. There you go. But time out. But you're saying it was that loose. I was like, someone's been here before. Of course. Oh, no? <laughs> Has there been somebody there? Obviously. <laughs> How easy did it, was it to go in? That's my point. Okay. It was uh, simple. It comes down, it comes down to- Simple. <laughs> hold on. Very simple to get so, in there. No, no, no. This is why I love making anal videos on how to do like beginner starters for anal. Because I've mastered- You do it a lot. Anal. No, 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 oh. no, no, no. Anal, if you mastered no. it, I feel like that means yeah, you practice. Yeah, that would be weird to I master practice, something and do it. but I practiced with butt plugs to figure oh, it out. Yes, and of I was course. asking like my gay friends like too. about like what the hell's going on. Um, because I I was so confused on how people could have anal and get enjoyment out of it. I'm like, one time I like my first anal experience was just awful. Like I literally tore. I'm like, how can anybody like this? Well, I feel tore. like you you start with a butt plug. Yes, you if you like want so, to prep you yeah. if you want to actually do a prep. Yeah, leave your booty plug in and then and like a half an hour it's before super, you go, just take nice. it out. It's, yeah, it's priming, right? Yes. But <clears throat> the key is if you're not prepared to have anal and you want to have anal, is this is a gay tip. Mm. As they're as they're putting it in, you're pushing out because a sphincter muscle is going to dilate because everything pushes out, right? Things leave. So you get it to dilate 
by pushing out and they push in and you use your breath. By then, you. but before you do anal, you don't just go right into anal, you have to have at least one orgasm because oxytocin will release in your body and that's the loving hormone Holy that will fuck. eventually relax your muscles, the dopamine sets in and then you relax and your muscles will dilate. So push out, so, so shit on the dick. I felt you trying to take a shit. Well, that's you, to make did it you feel the, the you. shit coming on the I other side? Felt no. Something coming the other way. There's definitely not. That. It was I like you were, it was like you were touching dicks. Yeah, with something yeah, else. I was like, dude, dude. We dude. ate a lot of protein, dude. I like shit three times yesterday. Like, where I'm, the fuck was I? After the think? anal? No. Prior to anal? During? <laughs> <laughs> no, it was good. Yeah, I heard you breathing. I heard the breathing technique happening. Yes. I heard you. Okay. <gasps> That's is that, not is what that it the sound? Like. No, that's not what it sounds like. <laughs> <laughs> the Japanese came ass. out actually. <laughs> no, 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 that was no, good. No, no, no. I, honestly, yeah, honestly, I, I've never really done like anal missionary, so that was pretty cool for me. Yeah, it's actually one of the easiest ways to get an entrance point. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I didn't realize that. No, yeah, I, you don't want to do. I always don't recommend doing anal in a doggy style position. That's the first way I did it. Yeah, it's but not. We, but there was a butt plug in there for about like two hours. Yeah. Before. Okay, that makes sense. We, and then we use lube. Oh yeah, lube. You guys didn't use lube? No. And it went in like it. simple. <laughs> <laughs> no, I because I had already had I think maybe one or two orgasms before that, so I was. So it's just easy then. Well, oh, no, I was her. fucking wet, wet. I don't know. I've never experienced that, but I feel like that makes sense. If you've done it, if you've done anal, like it, it, your the the Asshole's muscle, the bit. muscle gets like prepared for it's like, it. It's like more jacked than other people's asshole. My booty hole's jacked. <laughs> yeah, but that's why I was confused because I was like, "This is like another vagina," and it should feel more like a, uh, you know, you had already been in it for. And it's not like you were doing slow strokes. No, but when you went in, did it feel like another vagina? No, it felt like an asshole. Okay. You're right. For that one moment. I want to say for five seconds, it felt like an asshole. The rest of the time, it felt like a V-hole. Because you relax. I trusted you. You, you relax. Want, yeah, I relax. Oh, oh, oh. So I relax, and it's easier I for you. I wonder why you trust me. And I wonder why I don't trust you. I wouldn't let you put anything in my asshole. A finger? Did it? Did you? No. Yeah, you did, did a little bit. No. Did you? Eat, not did you? Eat, did you? No, eat I ass? didn't want to. No, I didn't need his you ass. You did put your finger near it. No, you did one moment, and I, I freaked out. Oh, whoa! Yeah, didn't but I, I wasn't actually gonna put it in. That's not normal for him. He usually accepts that if he trusts people. <laughs> 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 <Jesus>. <laughs> Honestly, my butthole is very tickly. Okay, so it's just more of like a stimulation because there's so many nerve endings that are around your anus that you, mm -hmm. like I would never just go in without having like a conversation. Like, do you like butt stuff? Do you like anal play or anything? I don't think you had a conversation with me. Exactly, but that's why your I didn't put my- Your finger was near there. It was close to being in there. I like, who? It's called you panicked. I panicked. Do you eat a lot of ass? No, I don't eat a lot of ass unless like I know know you. Okay. Would you, are I've you going to eat his ass, you think, tonight? Uh, it depends how this podcast goes. Oh, what the does that mean? What does that mean? Oh, no, actually, sorry. Like it depends on the hour that we might have sex because Chris's energy and, like, you know, his the mood, the mood swings. swings oh, like, yeah. Is there a certain hour that it happens? Every fucking hour. Oh, every hour is a different hour. Oh, yeah. yeah. You were, what were your three moods again? Indecisive. Indecisive. Let's fuck. I, I don't know if there was a third But one. it is pretty interesting. Happy and chill. You guys did post a TikTok about indecisiveness, right? You were like, oh. That was it. Do people don't know that about you? I don't think people realize how fucking insane things are from hour to hour. How come you didn't tell me? Did you lie to I, me? You I just mean, left that out. I Why didn't did leave you do any, that? I, that's just who I am. You that's not a me? part of like something I could tell you. Yeah, that's true. First that off, you, ex you experienced it over the phone multiple times. I literally said to you like multiple times, like I would just like text you, be like, "Yeah, I'm feeling crazy right now. Like I can't, I can't talk to you." Didn't I say that to you one day? I was like, "Hey, like I'm just in a weird place. Like I can't talk." No. Yeah. I'll literally pull up the receipt. 
I will. Okay, cool. I'm very honest. I don't know why you don't. A lie. How so? You might have said something about a conversation, but you definitely. Well, how much did you guys talk before you came? Like every day, right? I would say we're both pretty shitty texters. Yeah, not texting. I'm saying on the phone. Maybe a couple times a week. Okay, and you didn't see changes in behavior? 100%. Not until, not until you did trend. Yeah, the last week and a half has been crazy. Yeah, and that's when I was like, whoa. <laughs> yeah. Oh, am I walking into the same thing? I just left. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. So I, I want to go back, though. I want to figure out how you went to, I don't know if this is going to happen, to fucking her. Yeah, what happened? Wait, wait, what was the question? I want to, like, okay, when you first texted me, like, I don't know what the fuck to do here, and then you ended up having sex with her. So how did that... I had sex with her prior to that. Oh. I had sex with her... No, you didn't. Wait, wait, wait. No, you didn't. Are you talking about, are you talking about the text I sent to you? Yeah. That was at night. Yeah, that was, it was in the morning. It was like six in the morning. I was like, holy fuck. Oh, yeah, he was in his feels that morning for sure. Was that the day you talked to me in the shower? It was the first that was, morning. That was the day I, yeah. Well, I talked to you in the morning that time, literally within an hour of that. Yes. As I'm saying, when I have feelings, I'm going to be really honest. But you had sex with me when these feelings had already set in. I had sex with you the night before. Yeah, but you were definitely feeling some type of way because your energy was off when we went to bed. Yeah. <laughs> why, why, why was the, uh, so it was because that was the night that you found out that she had, she was vegan. vegan and then also that she had sex with two guys in one. I didn't. Okay. I'll be honest, like really blatantly honest. Like the first night, I don't know if it was weird because also it was the first time I smoked in a little while because like, you know, obviously we smoked together. And it was like, because it was like the first time we were meeting, I felt like maybe both of us were like, you know, maybe I was just in a weird mood. Honestly, I don't know what it was. You it's could say that. probably because you smoked, maybe. Honestly, I think that was it. And then obviously the moodiness that has been happening lately. Um, Did you feel weird the first night? No, but I like talk to, my, my job's to talk to people for a living. Like, I'm very social. But you weren't feeling like uh, weird in the sense that, oh, is this the same person that I've been talking to? That I had felt prior, prior. to coming. Okay. But when I, my, like, when I came, when I landed, I was like, just run with it. Yeah. And that's kind of how I run my life. Like, is just like, whatever you're here, you, like, just make the most that you can and go with the flow because you never know what opportunities are going to come. And I was lit. Like, when I got off the plane and made a nice business connection, had, I talked to strangers all the time. So I'm like, hey, how's your day going? How was oh, your flight? Shit. Like, okay, okay. like, I'm very, like, on it. So when I got to his car, I was already like, I'm, I was just, my cup was just filled by yes, these yes. beautiful couple that I oh. interacted with. So, like, you came in very high energy. Oh, yeah. And then when you got in the car, was it low energy? No. I no, I don't think it was low energy, but I do feel that when he smoked, yeah. But I also understand how that could happen because I, I just came off of a smoking break. Okay, Because yeah. of that. Like, when you just get in your head and you get, like, the anxiety and yeah, that's not yeah, cool. Yeah, it's like, yeah, why yeah. am I doing this? This is supposed to calm me down, not yeah, make things yeah, yeah. worse. Okay, so then Also, I felt like you were attacking me the first night. Oh, because I throw shots a lot. I'm like quite shoddy. Like, because I but think. But he usually likes that. I'm like super sarc. Oh, that's what it was. You didn't understand my sarcasm yet. I remember you saying Damn, that. Damn, bro. The tables have turned. No. Because <laughs> it was like excessive. Or, or no, no, no. Oh, you know what really what it was? I felt like I was being sarcastic and then you were just like going really hard. And I was like, this is really abrasive. And like, yeah, maybe you're being sarcastic, but you're really like going hard dude you make fucking shots at my trauma that that's doesn't funny count. though no trauma's not real <laughs> that's a real thing no trauma technically isn't real seriously read a book <laughs> <laughs> what you experience is actually like, bullshit no no, no no i'm serious because you actually put the meaning onto anything that happens in your life so no matter what it's actually what meaning you decide to put towards that event so even if something traumatic did happen to you Actually, the whole point is to try to put a different meaning onto that event. Can you to do make that when you're eight years old? Like make a no, joke about it. You can't do it when you're eight, eight years, years old. old. No, but you can do it when you're fucking 20. Why do so you, you were making fun of her trauma. No, it was not. See, yes, no, you were. no, I was not. Do you want me to bring I out some of them? Because I remember. Oh, let's do it. Go ahead. Okay, you made fun of rape. What, what, what do you mean I made fun of rape? 
That's not funny. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, I gotta um, go back to the You made an abuse joke? Uh, what, how so? What did I say? You what said you something about? about my stepdad. What about? I don't, I don't remember, remember this. Damn, so you were just shitting on her all hard, and then she shitted on you again very diff hard as well. Okay. I just felt like there's alike, no, no it's a problem because oh, no. you guys are too to much it. alike. Yeah, he's no, not used to it. you're not used to getting shit on. No. Is what she's saying. No, no, no. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. <laughs> See, like, okay, it's like this. Okay, this is exactly what I'm talking about. And I do have the message right here. I did say something that was like, "Thank you." Honestly, I had a long day. Probably trend. I was like, I don't know. Hard to tell. I'll talk to you like later. So that's very different. I said, than what yeah. You just I don't know. Death feeling weird. Just have a lot on my mind right now. It's not you. I'm being real about my feelings with you. Yeah, of course. I don't remember what we were looking up, but I'm pretty sure it was that. Yeah, yeah. no, you were looking that up. What is that? Didn't I say that? You you said that I you totally told her that. that you were feeling weird. Hey, yeah, I don't know. Death feeling weird. Okay, no. We, uh, when you guys re-edit this, you'll see. He didn't say that, but okay, cool. We'll go with what that. Do you He's got a good memory. What do you mean? That is literally what the the word I remember for sure was weird. weird. I'm feeling weird. Yes, I remember hearing weird too, but you weirded, weirded it. Whoa. Weirded it? <laughs> weirded weird, it weird. Differently? I, t I said to you, I said, I told you I was feeling weird before you came and you said, no, you didn't. I said, yeah, I did. Yeah, that was the, that was it. Wow, I really have a bad memory. Yeah. But holy hell, that was like 10 minutes ago. It was. It was a while ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, it was a while ago. Maybe yeah, three minutes. I, I accidentally. I sometimes Did I forget fucking really two days. Really bad short term. Oh what? lord, I short need term, help. long term. Right. You didn't even know you fucked two guys in twelve That's hours. <laughs> do you guys believe me now? That you fucked two guys? I guess. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I kind of do. Maybe I don't know. Are you lying about that too? Is Which one all is the it? game? Okay, where were we just now? Now that we found that. Now that you've lost like four times now. Where else are we? Four times. Let's go for a five. Wait, where is what was? Where are we just going? You were talking about the conversation be, um, when you guys first got here and how hmm. it was a little weird. Okay, there was one point where like I feel like I was trying to be like real with you, and you kept joking, and then I stopped you, and I was like, ah, you know, whatever, and then you did it again. And then, uh, oh, 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 oh. She was probably nervous, I feel like. Were you nervous and you were just trying to make fun? Like, get comfortable? No, no, no. It was like, it was yes. like, no, I no, did, I no, did that exact no. Thing. Okay, maybe that's true. Maybe that's really true. To lighten the mood, you know? Okay, but mm, yes, but like, okay, you were doing it in a way where I was like, it you was didn't, annoying. You didn't like it. That's okay. No, no, I understand. I understand that you probably didn't like it because, but she probably was just uncomfortable and she was just trying to get comfortable. Yeah. I was telling her that like, oh, like sometimes I get like social anxiety um, when I smoke. And then she was like telling me about how like, oh, like, so every time you like smoke, you feel weird, like going out. People, I'm like, no, like actually I'm talking about just like more like at my house. She's like, oh, no, no, no. Like I understand like you just like don't know how to talk to people like when you smoke. And you just kept saying that to me. And I'm like, no, no it, this is not. I am a stoner. Like I've smoked weed before. You make, like, you're so making it sound. Understanding. Yeah, Correct. I feel like if she Mis was, miscommunication. Uh, yeah, yeah, I feel like she probably was going harder because she probably didn't feel comfortable in that situation either so she was just trying to make it like break that tension and then you were like you weren't vibing because you felt like she just didn't understand you as a person exactly yeah so personality at that clash yes a personality clash personality clash right but also you're not understanding the way i'm even communicating yes. to you which is frustrating to me. and that's what i was like that's where i was like oh fuck like we are like we haven't even been we haven't facetimed yeah, all yeah, week yeah. like maybe i was just like the whole time i was right about not talking to you well that sounds insane wait you were right you weren't so talking you, to her on did, purpose you did tell me that it's not you but it was me so you lied no, no, no it's not though because it was more me being like you know oh shit did i just pack you into a corner no uh, how so <laughs> Because how I feel do you, like how she do you feel like she got a W right now? She no, feels like no, you shouldn't feel like that because <laughs> at the same time, it's not you. It wasn't necessarily it's not you. you, baby. It's me. Right? Exactly. Mm, okay. okay, so what <laughs> turned it around though? Because right now is a, it feels like a different mood and energy than Absolutely. we need to abort this mission now. What did you say yesterday? It was really funny. Oh wait, I said okay. So it's like the song I played for him. 
I was like, I didn't really like this song at first, but oh my God, now I love this song. And he's like, yeah, I kind of feel the same way about our relationship or something. And I laughed. That was funny. That was really funny. So what happened? Um, he like waited what changed? to get to know me. <laughs> I think I think that was what it was more. Also, I'd given up on like, you know, because I had to make choices, quick choices. And so what I mean by that is, is like, I'm like, okay, here's, here's the situation. This is going to sound fucking insane, but it's the truth. Um, you know, I feel like there's, I had, okay, number one work, right? I wanted to stay focused on my grind. I've been really like trying to like post two videos a day, which isn't even really working out because every single day I'm getting just fucking distracted by shit, doing other shit that like is counteractive to like my true goals and my true desires in my life. And I feel like I people please the fuck out of everyone in my life in a weird way, but everybody still hates me. So I don't know. Anyways. Um, <laughs> just, there's no winning. What, at the end of the what day. have you been people pleasing? Every, everything. That's what I'm saying. I think just literally being in somebody else's presence is an L for me, or having to talk to somebody. That sounds crazy. I'm telling you, he's really sad. You just don't want to talk to people. No, no, no. I, it's not that I don't want to talk to people. It's just that I only have a finite amount of time in a day. Yes. And if I have multiple people trying to have a conversation with me during the day, very quickly my time gets taken up yes. talking and helping people with their fucking dating life. She sees it, bro. People just call me and start <sighs> dumping immediately. Just start telling me about shit that's going on. I've had to like have very like harsh conversations with people. But again, every Why single- Why do you just not answer it? I said set boundaries. Like sometimes we need to be better at setting boundaries and it's hard because a lot of people don't understand boundaries. They take it as like a direct hit, but really you're just trying to protect your energy. And I also told him too, like you can't show up for somebody when your cup is empty. You're yeah. showing up as a shitty friend in that case or a shitty ad advice partner. So you need to make sure that your cup is being replenished and refilled. And those are the people that deserve your energy. The ones that are going to refill your cup and then you'll refill their cup. Well, I just don't know why you answer somebody if you don't feel like talking to somebody. It's not that I don't feel like doing or it. Or like you, you, you it, I feel like it just is going to, yeah. Waste and, that's what, and that's what I told her. So the whole problem was, was like when she got here, I was like, yo, five days is a lot for me. I literally said that to her. I was like, yo, I'm really trying to fucking make it as much as I feel like this is going to work out. It sinks in. It's like, yo, you're long distance. I'm not even going to fucking see you after this date for a really long time. Like as much as I love seeing you, it feels like I'm choosing pleasure over work. I'm choosing, you know what I'm saying? I'm choosing to do something that's fun and be, have somebody in my house and host somebody when I could just be grinding every fucking day. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So like that was where it was like really hard for me. And I kept commuting. I was like, it's not that I don't like you as a person. I literally said it to her in the shower. I was like, yo, it's not that I don't While fuck with you. While you're fucking? No. no. I thought you were we were, we were at the point where it was not, there was no fucking involved oh. because also there was like, you know, and, and that's what I'm saying. That's why when there was miscommunication happening, I was like, what am I doing? Like I'm having somebody in my house and we're miscommunicating already. It's day yeah. one. Yeah. I was freaking the fuck out. I was like, oh fuck. Like she's about to be in my fucking energy for the next five days. And if I can't even fucking communicate with her, what the fuck am I even doing with this person? Never mind the fact, what am I doing with you being the fact that you know, as much as it's great that we fuck with and vibe with each other, we do live so fucking far away from each other. And I just did this with fucking Miami. Well, it's no, it's interesting because, okay, so I messaged um, my like uh, a listener who's like also a therapist and she told me a long time ago and um, this topic will be touched upon in the next podcast more heavily. But basically I messaged her uh, the quote that she told me from when I first talked to her probably year, a year or two ago. And she said, you'll keep dating the same person in different bodies until you learn the lesson. And I sent that to her and I said, that is fact. I was like, thank you for sharing this with me because I feel like this um, brings insight to my own life. This is what she responded to me. She said, it's very true. According to a more recent episode with Chris's new Canadian love interest, he hasn't really learned that lesson. He probably keeps choosing women who aren't real options for something long term because he's afraid of the vulnerability it requires to have something real and let someone in. A girl with OF who lives in Canada isn't going to be the person who he will have a meaningful relationship with. He's fooling himself. That's what she was. That's what she said. Damn, hey. Just, don't look at me. Look at you. No, I, I can, <laughs> no, no, no. I definitely can see that. She's got a very, very solid point, though. Like, I mean, she's. A, I call her Doc because, like, she's pretty she, cool. Yeah. No, yeah. she sounds dope. Um. 
So it, it's interesting because um, do you feel like that, Nappy? Do you feel like you date the same girls in different bodies? But the thing is, like, I don't choose that, right? The thing is, like, I'm not trying to date in the sense of, like, the girls that reach out to me reach out to me. But it, it, but it, you respond. Because she was the coolest person. Yeah. I didn't choose for her to be in Canada. But you're the dopest person in my life. Oh, woman wise. Oh, to this point. Oh, wow, I will that might say have been the nicest thing that you've said to me this whole time. I will say the vibe to me is very down to earth compared to um, maybe people in the past. Absolutely. Way different girl. That's what I'm saying. You're a different girl. We literally than meditated together two days in a row. Yes. That's what I'm saying. Like I literally said, I was like, if you were here, it would be different. I, cause I know for a fact, I, again, I wouldn't need to be fucking around with other people. Do you, but yo, so there have been TikToks that you posted and there is comparison between you and Miami on those TikToks. How do you feel about that? Talking about looks wise. I, in looks, general. Okay. Looks wise. I think people tend to gravitate and this is like a natural thing too, is that people tend to look alike when you have the same eye color, the same hair color, the same, same skin tone. But when it comes down to actual facial features and appearances, no, I don't think we look alike. I think you that- You look alike. I think we have similarities. I think that you look like another girl that he's dated in the past though, but he has a very- He's got a type. Uh, like the craziest person I've ever known has a type. Like I've never Every seen somebody girl most like, consistent. Boop, 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 boop. You know, like very consistent. You Are know? you consistent? No, I'm like all over the map. Same. Same. But that's, that's, it's that's very, weird. Yeah, I, I really just like do. Jack. It's weird. But now I have a type. Now I know kind of what my type is. What is your type? Um, they like have to have similarities in the sense of um, like driven. I need them to be driven. I guess more personality traits. Um, driven. I also want them to have same interests in me. Like I go to the gym six times a week. Like I want to know that yeah. you're coming to the gym too, or you don't have to come with me because I don't really enjoy. I was very, I was trained with specific people, um, but like physical appearance wise, I like dark features. Okay. I like tattoos. Hmm. I height's not obviously a big deal. So what about his blonde Jesus hair now? Christ. Oh yeah, that was a crazy comment. I just <laughs> passed by. <laughs> <laughs> but yo, you said dark features. He just dyed his hair. But it's not actually his hair. Oh, oh. So like, you, you know, he still has like the dark beard, the dark yeah, eyes, yeah, yeah, the yeah, nice yeah, eyelashes, yeah, yeah, the yeah, tattoos. Yeah, he goes yeah, to the gym. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like he's got piercings. Yeah, he's yeah, also yeah, hot. Yeah, yeah, I don't yeah. know about the whole different earring type thing. I'm not really down for that. But you do you, boo. Do you want my earring, bro? After this, we have different earrings. Do she doesn't like it. I haven't had. No, I like that. That's dope. This is confusing. I haven't worn an earring in so long, and it still has the holes, bro. I yeah, still have the that holes. That is kind of crazy. It's crazy. Your really lobes haven't. are weird. Your lobes like hold that shit, but I couldn't put anything on my lip if I wanted to. Oh, you have fucking gauges. Yep. Oh wait, what? Oh, <laughs> yeah, what? I've had gauges since I. Why'd was you in... say? Why'd you say like? Yep. Uh, I was like licking inside the holes. Without her. Yeah, earrings. that was fucking like. You I did don't that? like. That's I don't so like when people. Weird. <laughs> so, like, <laughs> that's like gross it feels like i don't know i don't know did it taste like anything i'm disgusting when it comes to that part honestly he like, used to have gauges did you know that really yeah zeros okay that makes sense why they went back yeah they're a little close yeah that makes sense they're a little like so like do you not like your gauges you said i what? honestly i do love my gauges i won't ever take care i won't take them out like when i was a child you i can't. had stretchy that's ears. why you have no choice no my sister's a plastic surgeon she can sew them up Oh, oh shit! Yeah, yeah. I didn't know you do that. Yeah, you can definitely. I know a couple of people that have had them sewn. What were you gonna say? Um. Yeah. No, my gauges have been around since I was a child. Like I think I, my ears were stretched what? when I was ten. And ten? Yeah, ten or eleven. That is fucking, insane. Where's your family? My dad. That's right. You had family trauma. I was. Wait, is your ones. dad like a tattoo artist or something? No, but my dad's like a rock star. Yeah. Essentially, he was like in a band. No, 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 no. Rock no, no. star. Like He's crack. like a rock star. Like I like jam out hard to rock, and I go to like metal. Heavy when was metal your punk. first like tattoo? Uh, eighteen. My mom's Asian. But I'm very confused though. But my lips were pierced before then. Why at ten you were like yo gauges? I, I feel my like my dad. My dad stretched my ears. He told he, you, yo, we're gonna get you gauges. He didn't tell her anything. He did it. He did it. He just did it without asking. She's ten. I'm ten. 
But that's what I'm saying. How does a 10 year old know? I, I, but like, I don't know, bro. That just seems a little interesting. I never heard. He also dyed my hair black and then sent me back to my mom's. I well, love what's him. Your, what's your normal hair color? Oh, my, this is my normal hair color. Well, obviously mine is like the shit. Oh, so it's like black anyways. Exactly. But when I was younger, it was like light brown. Okay. Yeah. Jet black you did. Yeah, I went blue black actually. Did you off. like the gauges when you were younger? Yeah, it really suited my personality. I was sad. It's crazy. As a, sad. <laughs> as a 10 year old, I can't even imagine like what that looks like. They weren't this big, obviously. Like once I got to high middle school, I just started stretching my ears with Vaseline and makeup brushes. And then Holy I, th I accidentally got to the size because I used to wear like heavier metals and they would weigh down my ears. And so now I like, technically I'm in, I could go up if I wanted to, but I haven't gone up in years and I have no desire. Like they're already at five eights. Yeah, it's a lot. Okay. So but they kind of make me look like an elf and I'm totally down for that. An elf. It's yeah. The opposite, I feel like, like you look I feel like, like an elf like is a pointy top. Uh, yeah, the top, not the no, bottom. Their lobes like go like out. It's cute. Like, like pixie, lobes. like pixie shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. I can see a pixie. Yeah. Very pixie. Like you could have um wings. Yeah. Okay, that's not yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not elf, maybe. But I could definitely see you being like Tinkerbell. Yes. Yeah. Like a man like trans. Wait, Tinkerbell wasn't trans? No, like if there was one. Like a trans Tinkerbell. Yes, yes. You could be the first. <laughs> Should doing... I change my like handle to that? Should that be instead of trans pleasure, baby? Tinkerbell. Tr trans Tinkerbell. <laughs> that would be actually huge. Y'all are going to get me canceled. No, no. no. <laughs> you don't like they, like, for example, Little Mermaid, they have a, now a black Little Mermaid. They could, huh? for, for um, huh? Peter Pan, it's going to be really? a trans. They have black mermaid? Wait, 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 wait. What? You guys didn't know this? The, no. the trailer just came out for The Little Mermaid. It's a black um, uh, Little Mermaid. So black Ariel. But she still has red hair. So it doesn't She matter. has red hair. She's black. Does she have green gills? Yeah, it's a fucking, like, fucking mermaid. No, I know. But I didn't know if they changed the gill color to no, like, no, purple. No, no, no. The purple was the top, I think. Yeah, purple is the top. Little shell. I think she still has the purple top. But yeah, no, so she, but like, like I'm saying, yo, the new thing would be fucking Peter Pan trans Tinkerbell and you yes, could do it. Yes. <laughs> Peter yeah. Pan is Indian. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yo, man, that's a lot. <laughs> oh, that's true. And then, ready, that's right. We and need like superhero. Captain Hook. Are they superheroes? No. Or no. Oh. Prince. Princes. Sorry. But, but Captain Hook would be actually a person who is disabled and didn't have an arm. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta get woke as fuck. Yeah. Absolutely, <laughs> being very inclusive. Yes, yes. Okay. Um. Did we? She uh, didn't touch upon like the whole like. Okay. Before this podcast, you were going off about the difference between you and Miami, and like I said, wait for the podcast. Now is your time. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. For starters, I'm not a bottle girl. I have an education too, actually. But you're a Wait, sex she, worker. And no, she, and I'm she, not a sex she, worker. She you're was going to med school. Worker. She was going to med school. She was. She is. She is. Okay, that's great. Let's see how that goes. Did you rate oh. your MCAT? Oh. I mean, if she, she, she must have got her MCAT if she's in med school. No, no, right no your now. MCAT, she's already in med school. She's in yeah. med school? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Okay. I don't. I don't know what's good. But you. It's, I mean, but how can you not have an intellectual conversation with somebody who's in med school? You could talk to my sister for hours, hours. Well, oh, you couldn't have intellectual conversations with her, huh? Um. Is this what you told her? <laughs> I feel like okay. Intellectual is interesting um, comment. I don't know what we mean by intellectual. Are we talking about, like, I feel like it's more emotional intelligence. Okay. Okay, well, then that's fair. That's fair. Wait, I don't I don't know if she's that book smart either. But, like, book smart she in medical be. shit. But, like, uh, it's like a bottle girl personality. Very surface level stuff. So you are you were actually offended that people are comparing you to. I think it's offensive when people compare others to others anyway. That 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 could make some like, sense. Like, do you want to? <laughs> that could make some <laughs> sense. Do I you feel like if compa somebody compared me to, like... I don't know, like Martin Luther King, I'd be very honored. It depends on who you're getting compared or to. Or like Gandhi how. or some shit like that. Yes. And how. Yeah, some girl said, uh, wait, yeah, what was the comment that they made on my... Uh, Something about me being uglier? Yeah. You really want to hear it? Yes, let's hear it. Um, hey, it'll be. Um, lol, LOL, bro, what you doing? Uh, comma, Miami was way hotter. Ooh. Not gonna lie though, the videos that you have posted of me, 
Don't act like it's the videos. It's not. It's probably my actual face is busted. No, it's not busted. Do you need glasses? No. You didn't strike me as somebody who needed glasses. I No. You, don't listen to that comment, okay? I'm not. Because there's other comments. <laughs> there's other yeah, comments. All right, let's, comment is let's, go, let's go to the... Um, Let's go to this clip. Um, hold on. There was other comments on this video. At first thought this was Miami. Love her. There was one that I read that was good. Um, um, someone said, isn't this the last girl? Yeah, a lot of people were saying that. Yeah. But to be honest, I don't really see these except for the hair color. But like, what did you say, though? Prior to this podcast, you were like, what, what was the word? I'm not fake. Yes, I'm not fake. <laughs> Damn. Is it? Are you calling? No, I'm. that's her personal choice to morph her body into something that God didn't give her. That's cool. Oh that's yours. My. But my mama made me just fine. God! And I built my ass. Wait, did she have a BBL? No. She didn't have a BBL. Okay, perfect. She just has fake titties. and She just got the fake titties. I'm not going to lie. I do fuck with fake boobs if they're done right. And I also do like lip filler. Um, Are you a lesbian? Yeah, I'm bi. Or not. Uh, yeah, bi. That's what I meant. I'm sorry. Not lesbian. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, Are so like, she's pretty. She's definitely so beautiful. You, would you fuck? Would I fuck her? If you didn't know. If, she if didn't I speak. didn't. If she didn't. No. Oh, oh, is she it's short? Not your, How tall is she? Uh, She's like. An inch or two shorter than me, two inches. Are you Three. into short girls? Yeah, I like like small brunettes. That's with like tattoos, kind of her no with tattoo. colored eyes. No I'm very specific. Has, like the bar for women is very high. much so higher. She has than colored men. eyes. What color? I think green. Dude, you looked into her eyes and you don't know the color of her eyes. Must yeah. not have been special. No, she's special. There you go. Oh, oh, you do feel special about her. I, I feel special about loser. everyone that I was with. Wait, why can't... Wait, what was that? What was it going on? Yeah, what did you say? What did you say? Say it with my chest. There's wounds there. No. I, there's no wounds there. I just had a conversation. I don't talk to her. She's cool. Like, we're boys. I'm still allowed to be her friend. I feel like you, I feel like you don't like... I, I feel like you don't like being compared to her because you feel like you are superior. No, I'm not superior to anybody. Okay, yes, yes. That's a good, that's a good now, like, uh, I don't Compassionate know. Compassionate Buddhist Buddha statement. shit, yeah. yeah. Which is nice, I like it. And I by you saying that, I feel like his superiority are, is there. You guys, <laughs> in a way, yeah. It's uh, just two I, different, it's two uh, different people. Yeah, two different people, two different personalities. Similarities in, as far as looks, yes, Chris has a type. Um, Similarities in terms of um, flying here. Yes. yes, getting on flights. Getting on flights. That's similarities. Very similar. Similarities. But sex I work. also wouldn't sex work. It, well, the she wasn't a sex worker. Yeah, well, Bottle Girl is just a modern day sex worker. Fuck man, I really gotta delete my OnlyFans. That's this not is really sex setting work. me back. Why is it? <laughs> Why is it setting you back? So having an OnlyFans. Okay, so first first problem that I'm gonna encounter in my dating life is one that I talk about sex and then I'm openly uh, I'm open about my sex life. I'm open about sexual that's encounters yeah. that's gonna you be think? hard yes because men view that as that's gonna be easy when in fact it's actually not i don't I've, think that's necessarily true no well if people see sexologist or something on my dating profile or it's linked to my instagram then it's linked to my youtube they're gonna be like oh yeah this is gonna be a good fucking lay like i had sex with a sexologist like da 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 it's You're gonna be more of a like box. a yeah I more like a prize like i got I, one I, like yes, a milf yes got I, it. I do think that i think it is because he was hyping it up like you were gonna be amazing and blow his mind with sex did that happen probably not i haven't known him long enough Oh, I think, you, like, oh, you think it's a length thing? I do, kind of. So it wasn't that good is what you're saying? I feel like no, it was good like for good. you. Oh, for you. Oh, wow. Hey, truth comes out. Oh, wow. No. Hey, hey. no. Baby, baby B. No, no. Say no, it. No. Say it. It's Did you been come? Excellent. Did you come? Not recently. No, but also, also this was it? relies on a... Go ahead. Go ahead. No, no, no. Everybody knows everything. I, okay. I know you're not. <laughs> like, Wait, what do you... He relies on a pill. I mean, that's normal for him. It's like a pill and a bees. Yeah. Well, is that bad, though, for... No, I definitely don't think that's bad. I don't think that's something that should be shamed either. Yeah, you it should, should shame be... somebody for yeah. a fucking disorder that he has. That's good. Yeah. No, but I honestly don't know if it's a disorder for you or if it's something that's more of a mental thing. 
But that's still the, some type of it's uh, ED I, from anxiety. I, I don't. I don't. That's called so, uh, anxiety performance. Yeah, performance, performance anxiety. anxiety. Holy but is Miranda. it performance anxiety? No, I don't think. I think you're confident, but I think the fact that you rely heavily on the blue pill, you believe that you genuinely. It's not the blue pill. It's orange. Yes. What's the blue Cialis. Viagra? Viagra. I, I have Viagras, but I hate them. Cialis makes you no Viagra gets it up. Cialis m makes it hard but, for longer. No, Cialis Pump just brings lasts, blood flow. Cialis just lasts longer. That's why Cialis we take is it like a thirty-six a hours, whereas Viagra is six. You got a six-hour window to fuck. Yeah, but Viagra is more intense in that six hours than the Cialis is over the thirty-six. I don't think I've had sex with anybody that's taken a Viagra. We could do Cialis it tonight. for sure. No, I'm good. Um, <laughs> you say that now. Yo, Until it I take makes it. it fucking huge. Until I take bro. it. Do and we then really you're need say, to make that larger? Oh, that's it again, excessive. again. That's an excessive again, comment. Again, I'm not talking length here. The I'm truth talking girth. is out. You have a fat chode. <laughs> <laughs> I'm listen. I'm not talking Chris about Nappy the here. fucking chode. Fat cock. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what's Wait, up? My name's so, Chris. But but they here's my thing. Thick You're saying daddy? is that is why it, you called yourself thick daddy? No. Okay, just I was actually just like thick for a little while. I was looking like a bowling ball for a little bit. You missed out on. Did your days. dick look like a bowling ball too? Probably. <laughs> it's like yo, you had your you had your regular balls and then your fucking ball for a dick. <laughs> you have, oh, that's what I want to. You have really good balls. I just don't believe that because he told me that his balls are inside of him right now. No, no, no. Okay, here's the thing about the balls thing. Remember back in the day in college, I said that I had the biggest balls? Yes. So that's the thing is I'm already coming from very large testicles to begin with. Okay, so they just shrunk a little so, bit. So that's the problem is now they're regular. Didn't did you, you feel like they were extraordinary balls or did you feel like oh, these are regular balls? Dude, I just dated a guy that did a shit ton of gear. I don't. Oh, know. so that's probably it. You're dating a lot of guys that are on testosterone. No, nope, so just one. Okay, so one guy. He had no balls. He had tiny testes. He had tiny testicles. Like, okay, let me see with your hand how big. Well, they drop obviously when they get aroused, but they like They're like really tucked into his anus. Didn't you say though that you were fucking a girl that she didn't like the fact that your balls weren't big enough or something? That was back in the day that she liked them like slapping against her. <laughs> I don't remember. <laughs> I remember that. That's what I think the no. conversation stemmed from of you saying that you had small balls is because this girl's like, oh, you don't really have like big balls. I I know for a fact they don't have the same juice as they used to. Okay. What's that ACDC song? I've got big balls. I don't You've know. You've got big balls. Oh, nope. everybody's got big balls. Yeah, we've got the biggest balls of them all. My thing is, is my balls, they used to be... Ginormous. Ginormous. Remember, oh. I told you the story about me ball jousting my friends. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Is yeah, his, you did. Is his uh, dick bigger than the balls? Thicker? Yes. Okay, good. You hope so. Yeah. Yeah. And they've shrunk... Yeah. I don't know about the shaft. I mean, she said, again, fucking wide. Coke. Wide. Not as wide as a Coke can. You is said something wider, about... Wider than that? No. That's insane. That would be wild that I took that in the ass. That would be wild. <laughs> I mean... Absolutely wild. I think that... That's not bad. Yeah, it's, maybe. It's like a little bit closer. It's, it's not too far off. Maybe like the inner circle. Whoa, big boy. <laughs> okay, wait, 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 wait. That's a that lot. Back. I take it back. I need to draw a circle. Where? Oh, she's going to actually draw it. I've never gotten this no. close to seeing your no. actual size. No way. No, no, no. This is insane. No, that's that is that. insane. <laughs> again, 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 again. Show, show, show for the show people. Show the initial drawing. <laughs> I, I like don't believe so. Okay, yeah, show, show, the, show, show the drawings. Hold Maybe on, you're more. right. I think that first one's pretty accurate. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay, show the first one to the people. Uh, and these aren't balls. This is dick, dick girth. She said this one. Not that. This one. That's insane. That's nice. That's insane. That's bullshit. Chode again. Chode. Uh, okay. <laughs> Chode again. But you, okay. You made when, a comment about American men. Yes, you said that I was the nicest American man that you've met so far. Yeah, you're very polite. 
Well, I appreciate and easy that. Easy to engage with. But are there a lot of American men that you've met that aren't very yes. polite? Like who? Like Chris. He's not polite. I'm just kidding. He's actually really polite. He's Am I polite? polite? But not- you're not. I wouldn't use the word polite. You're mannered, well mannered. <laughs> you are polite. Oh, there you go. What the fuck's the difference? I don't know. It's a Miranda. I think it's just my vibe. You know, it, it gives off wholesome always. <laughs> it really does. It does. Yeah, there you go. That's what I try to like, do. Like, I trust you. It's my aesthetic. I don't know why. Like, I would trust you. I That's feel how like, I feel. Yeah. It's like, you know what? What about me? Big rape energy. You know what? He rape like- energy? What? Yeah. You can't just you, make can't comments. Just, just, that's the craziest comment ever. <laughs> wait, wait, Did wait, Did you just wait. say rape energy? Yes, but wait. No. Hold on. Let's, no. oh, let's just talk about for a second no. that I still got on this airplane after he said this comment to me. One of our that's first comments. Actually, this was shit. our first conversation. This was our first conversation. He I don't know me. if we could leave that. That's the craziest <laughs> comment I've ever heard in my life. He told Who me. says that? <laughs> <laughs> he told me that he was going to drug me with GHB. And I was like, wait, isn't that the date rape drug? He's like, yes, yes means no, no means yes. I got a rape kink. Oh, you're into that. No, not me. That's what he said to me. Oh, you said you had a rape kink. I did. (laughs) (laughs) Multiple times. And then also has made multiple strap jokes and strap multiple anal jokes. And I felt pressured to give you anal last night. Fuck no, you didn't. Yo, you got it. You got don't don't be saying that shit. That's wild. Is that real? No. No. She, no, 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 no. 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 You, I, I was, was actually, down. I was. That was the first time I was polite about anal. How? He asked probably. Normally, <laughs> he's the one who just like, oops, sorry, I just put it in the wrong hole. I just rammed it in. Are you I, okay? I, I said, I wish I could put it in your ass right now. He said, "What do you say?" He said, "Something like I think you should, or just do it like Nike." Yeah, yeah, she let me know. Just do it. She said, yes, I would like that. Yeah. I would definitely, that doesn't sound sexy. I wouldn't say that. No, 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 you didn't say it like that. Yeah, I would say it sexy. Please, sir. Yes. One more dick in the ass. (laughs) (laughs) But okay, so. What did you say? I don't really recall. Oh, you don't recall. What other American men have you met that you were like, oh, very not polite? Minnesota, like in Minneapolis. I feel like the more like standoffish, like. I, like I said, like I like to talk to people. So if you're, if I say like, "Hey, how's your day going?" or whatever, and you're like, "Who does that though? Who who just looks at you and somebody says that?" People, Americans is what you're saying. Yeah, Americans. I literally had it the last the other night when we were doing that interview. He like looked me down and he was like, didn't even give me a no. He was like, mm. "Oh, you're talking about?" So we went into Scottsdale to do public interviews. Yeah, the one guy she asked to do an interview with just like pretty much shut her down. But like. Without words. He was probably trying to fuck. No, he think he was in a fight <laughs> with his assumption. chick. I think he was in a fight with that chick with the BBL and the big old titties. Mm. And then she walked away and stormed off. And then I approached and I was like, hey, just kidding. I didn't say it like that. But yes, you did. No, I didn't. You were literally trying to hit on him. No, but I will give people sub eyes. They usually gets men. Like submissive? Yeah. Like you wanted to fuck him maybe, possibly. No. Oh no! You but say you, that now. you give you give them the fuck me eyes so that they pull in, but or like the subby eyes. For what reason though? So that they say yes. To what? To whatever they to like. To whatever this I is, want. This is called manipulation, Jay, and this is what she does for a living. I'm learning this. Yeah. I'm learning this. <laughs> <laughs> the sub eyes. <laughs> so is this why? Is this do you do that a lot on your OnlyFans? You give the sub eyes to subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good, Jay. That was fuck. <laughs> um, no. No. I have like mm-hmm. one picture I think with sub eyes. So how do you how do you get people to subscribe to you? Did you start your OnlyFans or YouTube first? Oh my YouTube. And then you were like, fuck yeah, I'm gonna do OnlyFans? Yeah, and then I I take breaks all the time. Like I haven't been on my OnlyFans in almost like what it's like three weeks or something. Like I constantly on going on breaks. Like I like I said, I'm the worst person to subscribe to because one, I don't talk to you because it takes too much emotional energy and I don't have time for that. Um Do you have a lot of guys that are just sitting in there that you just like make money, like passive income from when yes. you're not even posting? Yes. Dude, fuck. I think you really should make it just for a month. Keep all just the subscribers. To do it. Just keep all the subscribers and then never post again and make money off of them. And the beautiful thing is you don't actually have to do porn. I haven't done one thing. There was only one thing Yo. that I did where I was like, Miranda, 
that was a boundary for you? Because I have a boundary list on my phone. What is the boundary? What did you do? Uh, have you ever heard of JOI? Jerk off instructions. Boom, bingo. Yeah, so I filmed a JOI video, just like in lingerie, and I did it. I, I don't understand anybody who would like that. That shit is boring as fuck. Just hearing a girl talk, being like, oh, rub that dick right now. Yeah. Wait, wait you've, you've watched one. I, mean, I know what it is. I know the category. Oh, you watched one. How would you know I never exactly jerked off. how it is? I never jerked off to it. I literally Sounds like had you, to Google you've it. heard some instructions. I Yes, because I see <laughs> it. Yes. yes. It's not like I haven't. Oh. But I haven't so I, I never masturbated to it because I was like, this is the dumbest shit. I was like, anybody so you, watching this is bullshit. So you put it on, you're like, this isn't for me. Yes. Okay. Oh, I, try so I try a lot. I try a lot. I get not? that. True. You should. You know? I get that for sure. Like granny. You tried granny. Granny. I've, I've actually came to that. <gasps> you came to granny? I see. Hey, baby. Fuck That's the MILF. Little, We're yeah. going to 70 plus. Where's the retire home at, yo? Yo, you said a <laughs> long time ago, this is another one. This is weird shit. That's what I'm saying. I, I definitely have a wide variety of things I'm into. Yeah. One time you were saying that you were in Circle K and you like saw this like hot, like pregnant woman, right? And you were like, actually you saw her and you were like, holy fuck, she's hot. Yeah, I know I, she's not. She wasn't at Circle K. She lives in here somewhere. Okay. Ooh, mommy. Wait, would you fuck a pregnant woman? If it was your wife, I guess, right? Well, yeah. You no, better. I was thinking like I'd probably fuck this girl. Well, that's that's what I'm saying. I don't know if I would fuck a pregnant woman that wasn't like my wife, but I feel I, like, I am know, into pray like sometimes prego porn is I not feel bad. Like Miami I've would never, still fuck you. Oh yeah, with a baby in her. Like the 100%. boobs get juicy, <laughs> and their skin gets so glowy. Is that what it is? Maybe that's what it was. The boobs get fucking crazy. I, I I don't know what don't it know was. She kind of gave time. me this like <laughs> tender mom look. That's exactly what he's looking for. That's what that's tender what I'm saying. Mom. That's what I'm saying. I'm, I'm, for a mom? I'm down for that sometimes. That's why I would watch me, that. Yeah, me too. I love a mom. Is that, wait, why why do you say that? Yeah, but when I've jacked off to granny porn before, I definitely felt ashamed after. Like I, right. I come and I'm like, dude, yeah. maybe that was wild. I was yeah. like, I look at the video and I'm like, what am I looking at? Yeah, right yeah, now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like, what the fuck? How did I get down this hole? That's how I feel about monster That's porn. That's a PC. What? <laughs> yeah, watched, you're, you like I've that shit. monster porn. Yes, yes. Like, what is that? It's like monsters it's that have animated. and vaginas. Yes. One time I watched hentai porn on MDMA and I was like, what? But yes. it was just me and my girlfriend sitting together. We were just you like- You guys watching porn? Together, well, we were, like it was I friends. didn't know what it was, and so she showed it, and I was like, "Wait, what, she what, just what turned version? it on." What version? Yeah. Okay, because there's multiple like hentai. Could oh, be... there was like tentacles flying oh, around. Oh, that's like, what he likes. Yeah, that's what I like. Do you have a tentacle dildo? No, I don't have any. I got dildos. a cipher. Why do I? Why do I? Why do he I? He has a, a vibrator. Dildo? Yeah, that he uses on multiple women. At new. Oh, oh, you, you haven't used it. You don't you just like haven't that. Felt it. No, I think that's fucking whack. But I could see why girls might say yes to that in the moment because they're horny as fuck. But I'm like, nah, man. The, this guy's track record? No, not a chance. Oh, what your fuck track does that record. Mean? What is my track record of three time chlamydia champ with one gonorrhea? <laughs> I feel like a champion. That's nice. It, it's not that <laughs> that's bad. That's nice. It's Do not you, that so bad. you wear condoms to have sex with them? Yeah. No shot. Yeah, no. No. Are you on the pill? I have something better than the pill. Oh, you got the coil. Sure, we'll go with that. Is the coil? A, yeah, 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 yeah. The cork? The morena. The morena. What yeah. is it? It more or less so looks like a V. Oh, oh. What it's in your arm? In, in, no. Oh, that's the depo shot you're talking about. Oh. Ladies, if you are on the depo shot, get the fuck off. Oh, that's not real. Wait, that's why? Not good. That shit is not good for you at all. Really, no birth con birth control is good for you. But I'm really irresponsible. I'm no, we don't need to talk beating. about that on this podcast. We're we're this is, this we're is, a pro birth control podcast. Yes, very, and there's a lot of fucking people anti birth control coming out lately. Yeah, I'm not responsible enough for that at all. A lot of people are anti birth control for How women. Many babies, what I have already. I don't, don't want to hear this. Why? Literally, she says that she's uh, her nickname is I'm a semen demon. I'm like, don't tell other men that. Why? Do you want to hear that, Jay? You want your girl that you're fucking to say, hey, I'm the semen demon. What's up? If it's all my semen. Yeah. 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 It's not. 
It's two other dudes in the same. But night. also, I don't know a semen demon. That sounds like scary. You know, you don't want a I was demon. A little frightened. You, you should know? be scared. I'm gonna suck your soul out. Did she suck your soul out? Was there ever head given? Yeah, but I haven't tasted his cum yet. Do you want and I to? I haven't been in enough positions that where I like giving head. So and why don't you fucking do it, sexologist? What do you mean you haven't been in enough You've positions? You've been so moody. I don't know. No, don't, don't see. Know. This is the bullshit. I no. don't know. Is no. it really that crazy? Okay. <laughs> No, she you makes look, it seem she, like she's she a horror like, movie. Yeah, 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 she's like, yeah, get me out of here. Yeah. She's like, yeah. <laughs> she's just sitting here, like looking at me, staring at me, like, dude, dude I gotta get out of here. Go help me, Jerry. <laughs> what positions? I'll fix your car. <laughs> <laughs> what positions do you give head that uh, we haven't that you couldn't give me head? Yeah, what does that mean? Positions to give head. Optimal position for like giving head game is being beneath them. Because I, I can access everything. Well, why couldn't you get beneath him? Why can't you just be like been stand like up? Laying down, and I don't know. Actually, that's a really good point. What do you mean being? So maybe a him? part of me maybe like doesn't feel comfortable standing. with you. Oh, what? I don't know. This is you're just saying this shit. This is ridiculous. Oh, no, there's a lot of stuff coming out. I don't really know, you guys. What's my life? You don't know if you should be here right now. Yeah, what's happening? Do you think it's too late to book that flight? It, first off, yes, it's past the time. You would have left this morning. I could probably catch a red eye. No, literally the next flight out is tomorrow. Trust me, I checked. Is that what you... <laughs> <laughs> I know all the flights back to Winnipeg from Phoenix, actually. So, yeah. Tell me again out. why I'm going to have sex with you. <laughs> I, I don't... Well, you. I feel like you want to have sex more than me. Oh. Yeah, but that's just because that's just who I am. Yeah, you're horny. So, like, sometimes you're just like, let's go, and that's why he's not coming. is because he's not really into it. No. Jesus. Like, like I said, well, well oh could, be, could be. Could I, be. I don't think that's what it is. Why haven't you came, then? Because I have a problem inside of me. How many times have you came? Every said, time yeah. except for without the blue pill. It's not blue. Oh, it's orange. Oh, me. And also... Yeah, just the last time. Which is so strange because he is the one who is um, initiating. Yeah, I'm horny. Yeah, but you can't Doesn't perform. Mean I can't. Oh, fuck. Where's the, where's the, what was the best yeah, time you saying, guys have where's had? Where's my finale? What was the best time you guys had sex? <laughs> was it the first time? You'll get it. Interesting. You're going to answer that question. I'm not answering it. Why? Because I don't know the answer to that. I don't know the answer to that either. No, yes, you do. Go ahead. You got to have a time. I'm trying to. Or think. it was just all amazing or all I feel trash. Like it was all, no, it wasn't trash. Okay. There wasn't trash. Even like when he can't finish, it's still not trash. You know, still worth coming out for. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, for you. Damn. Damn, you're yeah. savage as shit, hey? <laughs> yeah. like, You're savage as shit, hey? <laughs> hey? <laughs> Fucking Canadian in this podcast, bro. I like it. Okay. I wasn't saying Can you remember like, when you cried about me being savage and then you make remarks like this? Why are you being such a cunt? Why can't I be oh, a cunt back? <laughs> Stop being a fucking cunt, bro. Can, I'm not being a cunt. Yeah, I you got joking. cunty vibes. <laughs> no, I'm not. How am I having cunty vibes? You know what, Chris? See you next Tuesday. <laughs> Next Tuesday. Wait, what does that mean? Back? See you next Tuesday. Oh, it's cunt spelled out. Yeah, you just need um, to say that to people that you don't like. Yeah, all right. See you next Tuesday. Oh, that's good. You're like calling them a cunt secretly. Yes, so you're lying exactly. to people as per usual. Fucking. <laughs> that's good. Just keep it going. Manipulating people, lying to people, having sex with people that you shouldn't. I think everybody has the capability of being manipulative, and everybody is manipulative. Yeah, good point. Everybody fact. does have the capability, but some people choose to Actually, have consciousness. I don't. I don't necessarily believe that. I think some people suck at manipulation. Like they can't do it. Oh. Oh, they're not, just not good at it. Yeah. Or they they don't they don't have it in them to manipulate. Yeah, I feel like it's me. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Right. I don't uh, know. You know him better than I do. Well, I don't feel like I get manipulated. Well, that's good. I don't feel like I've been manipulated at all. I feel like I've been manipulated. How? It's this whole scenario. Shit, the vegan thing was huge. 
Was, that was like the number one thing. <laughs> like how? Though? Why are you fucking lying about BV? <laughs> Why are you lying about BV? I'm a fucking goddamn flexitarian, Chris. Yeah. How many more like different it. ways can I spell it out for you? Which was the best time? I don't know. Pick one. I feel like you know what sh you want her to pick. Yeah, I honestly, yeah, I no, do feel like no, she does know. No, like, what do you want true. me to say? See, that's what I've you, squirted twice, so that's no. pretty good. First off, more than that. You squirted. M more than that. You're a squirter. No. Sometimes. Exactly. Oh, so she, you made her squirt. 100%. You, you don't squirt she, normally. No, I normally squirt. Oh, okay. Well, oh, yeah. Interesting. No, it Last depends. Last two times you had sex, you didn't even come. Okay, wait. Wait, what? You literally fucked two What does people. he do that's so good that makes you want to come? <laughs> okay, so I... <laughs> <laughs> that's an insane question. <laughs> It's actually not him. It's what his mama gave him. No. Fuck you. It's the curve. No. Now you have a curve too? Yeah, the curve. <laughs> the, the, the curve. There's no winning out here. <laughs> a curve chode. <laughs> <laughs> it must be a fucking, a fucking small like. What do, you, what, do you, what do you think the curve is? What do you mean? In the dick? Yeah. Yeah, it's a curve. Which way? Upside down. I think he's talked about this before. I think that. It would be a up, no? Yeah. 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 So you think it's just a dick? No, I honestly think oh. it's the way you thrust too. Like that's like a huge thing. It's like, I feel like a lot of men get stuck in the um, in and out, in and out, in and out when it's not actually in and out. Porn shows you in and out, but it's more of a, like when you're dancing on somebody, it's like you're grinding, like you're moving your hips, like you're, and it's not necessarily super, you have to be super deep. Like deep penetration is good when necessary, when like needed, but you're not going to go in and be like, bam, 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 bam. You're going to slowly go in because the G spot is only like two inches in. So if you really want to get her good, you stay shallow for a bit. Get that engorged. Oh, so you're very good at staying shallow or is his dick it's just not long wouldn't. enough? <laughs> <laughs> so he's just not deep you know but sometimes you don't need to be deep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> there you go okay so that's what it was you said something else too what did i say you said that i'm i have good variable speeds oh yes yes what does that mean well okay he's kind of the perfect balance between perfect is a great perfect word. is a great word it's a great word to hear that. during like describing your sex that's 100 you know? we like that okay good he's a good balance between um perfect per sorry, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> he's perfect, <Word> perfect. <laughs> <laughs> he's a perfect balance between uh dominant meets uh sensual oh 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 oh, oh, oh. sometimes i can't understand what he's saying i'm like what the fuck did you say <laughs> Oh, me? Yeah, because you like whisper, but you like whisper with your mouth like not open, which is strange because you have a large mouth. So it's like enunciate. You have a large mouth. I just have a large mouth. I didn't I didn't know that as Smile. one of my qualities. Uh, you have to enunciate better, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry. I, what, what was I doing that? I wasn't. Are you talking about during sex? Well, it's just in all aspects. I'm constantly asking you, huh? What? Because you don't listen to me. It's different. Don't blame my mouth. Blame your ears. Oh, now you're calling me deaf and blind? What am I fucking well, Helen Keller? You are. Stop <laughs> fucking with me. Dude, that's nice that you're fucking somebody with special needs. <laughs> <laughs> special needs trash come through. <laughs> that's really nice of you, bro. You know, <laughs> taking an A lot of compassion these days. <laughs> yeah, there you go. There you go. Miami, right. where you're at. Oh, where my. Where are you at? You got to come back. Yeah, she definitely is. Um, She's the most normal. Uh, I guess. Very A lot of special needs people I've been with. I feel like everybody just needs something special. I thought the special was you. Well, I'm providing the and special. And I'm the need. Like, I need. Special. Oh. Is, that's our connection. Is that good? I, I have a question you... for you. Did you ride the short bus in high school? That is fucked up. What do you Dave? mean by that? Yeah, let's <laughs> elaborate. I feel like there's multiple meanings. <laughs> do you guys oh. actually not know what the short bus is? No. Was a short bus? Well, fuck. Are you serious? I can't. Wait, what? What is that? The short bus is that a is Canadian like, thing? Is that a it's Canadian? Like, um, like disabled people ride on the short bus. Oh, holy fuck! That's fucked up. Yeah. You. So you would say you, you just told me you call me disabled? What the fuck? You just dude? call me disabled. Who did you bring on this podcast? I don't know. Special needs. 
I I'm, say a lot of things. I'm very uh, offended. Me too, as well. You, you know, know I didn't even know what a short bus. I didn't That's know what weird. that. Yo, I wouldn't. I wouldn't I've be only, that derogatory to people. You yeah. know, to say short bus. <laughs> <laughs> that's fucked up are right, you ready to lightning round we're two hours in is that okay yes unless there's something you no, want no I have nothing else are you okay with that we're gonna ask some questions okay. this is a good uh, actually question that's gonna come up because we did talk about this I think it's important to our relationship ready? great what is it lightning round alright lightning round um, you had a, t- a Telby. Yes, that's what that's the question. That's where it's going to start. Um, all right, so we're going to play the Telby, and here we go. Yo, Nappy and Jay. This is Christy. So what up, Christy? told me that her boyfriend needs sex four to five times a day. Uh, I thought that was wild. Like, that's a full-time job. So my question <laughs> for you guys is how many times a day would be ideal for y'all? Thanks so much. Love you guys. Bring back the sus sound. Ooh. Mm. Sussy sus. Mm. Go ahead. That's my question. That's why I got to answer that. Well, we all got to answer it. <laughs> I would say for me, it's one time. Oh, wow. I think one time a day is great. Like, why Why need to do it more? To me, it depends on the amount of days. It also depends on how long I've been fucking you. So, like, yes. after, like, if it's, like, the first times we're fucking, I probably need it more. Yeah. like, I'm thinking long-term relationship status. One time a day is my go-to. I understand. That makes sense. Law yeah. of averages. Yes. Probably once a day makes the most sense. Yes. We talked about this, though. I think four to five is insane. Four to five, four to five is another level. It reminds me of, like, when I was in fucking 19. That's what I was thinking. Like, I did that when I was 19. <laughs> That's not sustainable. No. I mean, again, it was the first time I was fucking, so I wanted to fuck all the yeah, time. Yeah, we all through that phase. And when you're in college, it's also you have no responsibilities. Yeah, you're able to fuck you whenever. Just, you just fuck all day and you don't go to class. Yeah. What was her name, Christy? Yeah. Yes. Christy, I have questions. What the hell does your girlfriend's boyfriend do for a living? He must work from home. Or a porn star. <laughs> he should be a porn star at this rate. He needs that. Also, how much cum does he produce at a time? I'm also kind of curious. I mean, he's probably that. not coming like a lot. He doesn't probably have huge loads. Damn, we sucks. talked about this. This is what I'm talking about. Remember I said to you, I said, does the load size have an equation to the amount of times that the person could fuck? I think so. And you said no. I, to me, I feel like that makes sense. Well, when you're fucking that much, that's insane. Like, of course you're seeming... Like, well, it's gonna it's gonna get smaller each time. Yeah, but what I'm saying is, is like you said, I said I thought my problem. I was like, I can only fu- my refractory period is very long. Like I fuck once and then like we're done until what the next eight hours or twelve hours or something. I mean, that's not that bad. No, that's what I said. I'm like, that's, that's normal. pretty normal for a dude. Oh, so well, how many times do you think that like would you want if you could fuck? Oh, I know the answer to this. What is it? No, I'm going to let her answer, but I know what the answer is. So you're going to see if she's a liar again. Exactly. This is my point. We're going to find out if she's lying or not. It really depends on my mental state, though. What does that mean? Like, for me personally, it depends, like, where I'm at mentally. If I'm in a good space. Tell me, yeah, the different mental states are in. Yeah, and tell me the number of times you want to be fucked in that mental in, yeah, state. Yeah, yeah. Give us the mental state and the amount of fucking you so do depression. in the mental. Depression, fucking nothing. Zero fucks. Zero, Zero fucking. fucks. Very happy. Probably like two to three times. Two to three times. In your average just fucking... Is my long-term relationship? Are you thinking about that style? Yeah, long-term relationship. Long-term relationship. I would do once a day. Yeah, I feel like that's normal. Yeah, that's like a good amount. And then like... On vacation in Arizona. The first time you're fucking somebody on vacation in Arizona. I hope if that person had a shorter refractory period. No, but what <laughs> what you would want though? What you would if you if is that you, what you're saying? No, 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 no. Is that you, what you're saying? I'm just like cashing shame on you just to like pick you. Um, if you could choose, how many times would you fuck him if you had the option? If he could just always get back up. Twice. A day. Yeah. Is that how much you guys are fucking? No. How much are you guys? No. Fucking? Maybe. I think we went what two two, one one one, two 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 one one. So there's been days where you're like, "Fuck! I wish I'd not got another fuck." Yep, there was one day for sure. <laughs> yeah. You felt my dick up, and I said, "No, I'm gonna continue reading." 
Wait, what do you mean she fucked your dick up? She felt my dick up. Oh, she felt your dick up. And you chose... I ignored. I ignored her attempts. That's okay. At that point, you gotta did have you try to suck rejected. the dick? No, no. And that's what I said. I said to her... I fucking... No. I literally don't know your mood. I feel like that is something that you would do. If, you, if a girl... if you, if there's a guy who's like, ah, I don't really know if I want to have sex, and you're a girl and you want to have sex with a guy, start sucking his dick. Big facts. Absolutely. Start sucking it's a, his it, dick. Well, there's nothing we can do. Yeah. We'll be immobilized. Yeah. We will then have to fuck you. Yes. So we'll have no choice. And then yeah. I'll hear about it after your post nut and be like, oh my God, I should have been reading this intense thing. You come in my life and you ruined it. You That's ruined my routine. I can't believe I'm doing these things. I can't even eat right. As I say, you can't you eat right. I tell her every day, you're ruining my life one hour at a time. Yeah, if there's anything that I got from this trip is that my cup is drained. I'm just oh. kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Yeah, because it's all out of your coochie. What? Uh -oh. <laughs> my coochie squirt, is drained? Squirt. Yeah, it was, it was a coming joke. Okay. You, you understand what I'm coming. saying? Like, you as in, coming. you lost most of your cup through your vagina. Mm. Do you feel that way? Is it the best sex you've ever had in your life? No. <laughs> I feel like he could say the same thing about me too. Because there's yeah, lots but, of different factors when it comes to sex. But he has like pride, you know? What, I'm supposed to stroke it? That's fucking stupid. He he believed that he did do well. He did amazing. No. Top 10 no. sex. Top 10. Yes. Oh, made top 10 list. Top five. Top five. Top five. Top three. Top three. Top three. Top one. Nope. Not top one. Who is it? Your ex? Yes. That's a correct answer. <laughs> of course. It's going to be a long-term relationship. No? Of course. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't say I love you, do you? I don't want that. Normally you do. I know. That's very I strange. I on my YouTube for saying that. I was like, that's fucking weird when people say that I love you shit. I'm so like, is that why you didn't? You were going to, but you. I have another level in me that she didn't get. Oh, she doesn't deserve that. A fucking all men say that. I'm like, when is this going to come out? I've been with you now for five months and you're like telling me you got these fancy ass tricks and still seeing the same shit. Bust it. Like, I don't got tricks. I don't got tr I don't need tricks. I'm not about tricks. I am your trick. That's right. Oh, you're pimp. <laughs> you got pimp life. I do. Yo. Just give me. I told you. Give me twenty percent. You said thirty, actually. And oh. then we talked about it, and I'm your pimp. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be Nabby's pimp. If you want to oh, fuck, right. contact me. Yeah, if you're yeah, trying yeah. to fuck Tim. All um, eighty twenty. All, all business relationships go through. Yes, through Jay. If you're trying to fuck. If you if you want to have sex with me, you literally can. But you got to tell Jay first. You got to send Contact your nudes me. in first. You, no, you don't there have to send Instagram. nudes. Send his nudes. You could be the ugliest person ever. There is a price, but. <laughs> <laughs> we'll negotiate that. Yeah, you might have a great personality. Yeah. I don't know yet. Yeah. Guess we'll find out when you fly in. Yeah. So. I'm very upset about this number two thing. I feel like you're talking She didn't shit. say two. Didn't she just said two. top three. So you could be number no. three. I know I'm two. You're not two. Oh, there's another guy. Oh, my God. Another ex? All right. You're just asking not to have sex ever again. Oh, go have sex with them. I'm done. Or the guys you both had sex with before that didn't let you come. The two guys. Are you ever going to have sex with them again? You think? No. Oh, All right, we'll see. I don't think I want to either. Oh, wow. uh, yeah. All of a sudden. No, I definitely don't want to. Mm. Why don't you think you came for them? Uh, one emotional. And then I got like fucked up when. <laughs> okay. For women, it's super easy to get turned off, right? Yeah. So I was doing this toy review for the company, uh, for this company, and it was like a couple's toy. So I was like, yo, I need a link. So I messaged said person, and I was like, do you want a link? I need to do a toy review. Awesome. Cool. Yeah, let's link. Oh, you're talking about, I thought you meant like you need a promo link. You're talking about let's link up to fuck. Yeah. Like, okay, let's, okay. Let's link, okay. you know? Yeah, okay. yeah, 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 yeah. I got it. We got that term. <laughs> okay. Okay, good. Um, and then bring the toy in. Motherfucker makes some crazy ass decision not to even think about what the toy is actually used for. Makes up his own use of it. It's like a wand. So he puts it inside of me with him inside of me what the and fuck? is like getting. How big of his dick, his small dick then, no? Or one's no. in the anus and one is in the cooch. No, oh. no. 
both are inside me. But this toy is very weird. It's a bless a wand. It's like, <laughs> where's the fuck? How do I describe it? It's like a microphone. I'm gonna shove my fist in your. Cooch you should try it. I'm going to. Please, and then spread. I'm going spread. to. No, 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 you're right. I'm going to try that tonight. <laughs> you also told me I was tight because I'm Asian. I said, no, no, no. What did I say? You really think these vaginas and Asians have correlations? They do. Oh, you have a coin slot. No. no. So then that's not. you. That me, no. <laughs> I'm just it, like, I, I, I answered. Yeah. It crushes your theory then. No, no, no. It doesn't. Because I said this to her. What did I say to you? I don't remember, apparently. You have a white vagina? No. It's not my fault. I have a wide set vagina and a heavy flow. No. Do you know what that's from? What oh, is that? I, I, that's, uh, don't give it to us. Oh, what is that shit? It's uh, the, the movie with all the chicks. It uh, is. And the, uh, the heavy set comedian Pitch girl. Perfect? <laughs> no. no. But I, I, it's that girl, it was, though. Yes, it was the one where they do a wedding or a bachelor. Oh, bridesmaids. Party. That's it. Nope. No? No. Nope. Is that it? It's way more classic. Taking it back to when we were in high school. High school. Oh, it's oh, mean, mean girls. girls. Good job, boys. Yes. I am sad that I didn't know that right off yeah, the bat. Yeah, me too. Wait, what was the question again? It Asians was... and vaginas. Oh yes. What did I tell you about your Asian pussy? I honestly don't know. I, I tried to reiterate. She doesn't it, remember shit, bro. Yeah, I mean, she doesn't remember anything. Yeah. All conveniently, really. <laughs> Just all the conveniently <laughs> remembered. I had a things. wild life. Okay. Yeah, that's what it's about. Yeah, this is why it's called trauma, right? Go ahead, tell me. No, no, it's just it, it needs to be a, a super exciting for her to remember it. Yes, mm. she only has a certain amount of space. Yep. Gotcha. I said you're just an Asian girl that's been around the block. Oh, which is strange <laughs> because I actually haven't been around the block. Oh, where have you been? She hasn't walked yet. Oh, she hasn't. <laughs> she just stayed here. <laughs> Yeah, she, has, she hasn't been around the block. That, where I've never been there. <laughs> yeah, where's no. the block? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, you're right. You're virgin. I told you, 2022 virgin. I'm reborn again. Wait, yeah. so you haven't been around the block? Is the that's that's a real thing? Yes, my friends call me Jenny though. Jenny from the block. Yeah, from the you block. You haven't been around the block. I haven't been around the block. So that how do you how are you a sexologist without being around the block? That doesn't. What do you sense. consider being around the block? Let's get that out first. <laughs> being around the block. What number are we looking for here? Oh, I don't know if it's necessarily a numbers game. No. Okay, But good, if you wanted good. to make it a number, no, I No, I don't want to. I don't okay. want to. I, I feel like to. if we're going to make it a number. If we're going to make it a number. I would say being around the block would be 80. Okay. Oof. I was going to say a little lower. Maybe 50. I was going to say about 50. I feel like you've been around the block if you've been 50 plus. Yeah. Okay. All right, go ahead and share. No, no, she's not sharing. I'm not. I'm not 50 plus. So she hasn't been around the block. No, no, no. She makes up the number. Just uh -oh. don't let her. Don't let her. Try what to. do you mean? Sexologist I manipulation. That's what this is. I feel like, have you been in long term relationships? Yes. That was the problem. Six year one. Seven okay. year. Okay. Well then, yeah, she probably hasn't been around the block. No, mm. she has. Well, Shut your whore mouth. Okay. So you've been around <laughs> the block. I've been. I've been. Yeah, I've been through the block. You've been through the block, around the block, I've been around in the, the block, block, in the block, anywhere there is a block. Do you feel weird that you think, do you think he's a whore? Uh, that is, that's a great question. No, I don't. Yeah, I mean, you Let's use go. the term, you use the term a couple times, so I just wanted to know if you thought he oh, was. Oh, that's my favorite word. You want to know why? Because it's so aggressive. Okay. okay. Whore? But yeah, you don't like, think, you, know, you don't like, think he actually is a whore? No. No. I'm not. As I fucking tell people, they don't fucking listen. I don't think he's a whore. I think maybe in the past, but I think all of us have been a whore in the past. To be honest, I'm more of a whore now than I was in the past. What? Right, Jay? I would think so. I'm yeah. not a whore, but actually, wait, you slept. Okay, I'm starting to think you're a whore. Not a whore. Have you been lying to her? Never. Have I? Go ahead. That's what I thought. <laughs> <laughs> I, there was one FaceTime, though, where I was like, oh, that was a lie. And you told no. me you were like, and then I threw something at you. I was like, but you haven't lied in three years. I haven't. This is, that's what he says. It's the truth. It's the truth, though. Is it, though? Or is that a lie? Yeah. Is it? Are you just manipulating us all? You did fuck my brain the first night I saw you. Oh, you I, fucked her brain? Oh, my God. No, so you head just fucking just smashing. No, like, face he fuck. actually fucked my fucking head up. And I was stoned. And I was like, whoa. Wait, what? what? The way that you carried it out for over an hour is sadistic. Oh, you big brothered her. I, I love doing that. Is making it seem like... Somebody who's going crazy, but like... No, no, no. 
it was real life and she didn't know what it was until it was real. What was it? It fucked me. I said. He was like, I'm going to control your mood from a reflection standpoint. Cause he was like, you're matching my energy. And was, of course that's like what a no a conversation. No, what the no, fuck that little happened. fucking ritual ass shit. Are no, you on bro? No, 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 no. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to control your mood. This is <laughs> Literally no, it no, it's not. <laughs> Yo, just so you know. I said the reason it's weird right now, because it was day one. I said it's the reason it's weird right now is because I'm being weird. I said that to you. And I said the reason you're being weird to me is because you're a reflection of the way that I feel inside and the, and the things and the way that I'm to, um, like approaching you. I was like, you're, you're a mirror to me. You said, no, no, I'm not. Like, I'm just doing my thing. Like, why do you think that I'm even doing that? And then like an hour later, you came out of nowhere and was like... Uh, what was what was the comment you made? Something you're like, chill. yeah, you you were like, the only reason I'm not being chill is because you're not being chill. Oh. And I said, yeah, that's right. I told you you were being a mirror, and then you said, oh wait, and you got mind fucked. Got him. You played with my brain though, like it was plaster scene. Well, this is what I tried wait, to tell what did you. you call it? Plaster scene. Plaster semen. Plaster, plasticine, plasticine, plasticine. Play-Doh. I think, I think they say that differently in Canada. Oh, oh I know you're, I know you're, um, um, it's like plasticity or. Uh, no, no. Um, Sticky tack? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's that called? It's not called plaster scene. I think it's just called plaster. But maybe the full word is plaster scene. Yeah. In Canada, we, in America, we just should go plaster. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, yes. Then I fucked her. After fucking her brain, which is what I do. That's my thing. Remember, fuck the brain, then fuck the body. But I actually like to fuck the brain, though, too. Yeah. You don't really like that, though. No, I do. I just haven't had a chance. I haven't got around to it. You haven't got good head, you say, ever. You never get no, good he head. No, he said he said he had really good head one time. January 2021. Yeah, or 2022. a long time ago. One time. One person. One time go fucked up completely are you good ahead you think you're pretty good i would say yeah and i've definitely been told like i've been told somebody can't come from other people giving them brain because i fucked them up well, which is true when i get really into it but unfortunately with the climate change here i've been really struggling with dry mm -hmm. mouth mm -hmm. and yeah, it really it's the is a really <laughs> fucked no it's so dry here <laughs> it's so it is dry, dry it here. is dry here Jay, I drink two to three of these a day. And you're still dry. I'm still like. Is everything dry or just yeah. your mouth? No, there is a moment. Remember? Yeah, but that's because I was turned off. You did something. What oh, did you do? You know what happened? It was an energy shift. There was an energy shift and I felt the disconnect. That's what it was. Damn. No, that's an mm -hmm. excuse for you not being mm -hmm. wet, pussy. Dude. And I said, thanks I for that dry pussy. I like it. Yeah, he does like it. I literally said that to you. Mid-sex. I said, I like dry pussy. This I feels good. I said that a couple of times. Yeah, I do like when it's If you dry. weren't circumcised, you would have a different comment to say. That would probably hurt. If I wasn't. Yes. Yeah, that's why I don't like it, I think. You Maybe can't. that's why. I never fucking like no dry pussy, yeah, bro. Yeah, no, because it pulls on it your- It hurts. Yeah, it does hurt. It pulls on your foreskin, or the frenulum. Is that what it is? I yeah. didn't know that. I just knew that. You can actually tear that. If it's, too, if it's dry, dry, you can actually tear the frenulum. Yeah. I don't actually like it dry, but sometimes- <laughs> But you also don't like it wet, which is fine. Lots of guys what don't like what? it really. I, you were like, I, I, I kind wet. of agree with that too, though. When it's too wet, it's like you're not even fucking. Yeah, well, I, I it's like it just seems like there's nothing there. You know, you don't feel yeah. anything. Lost sensation. Yeah. Space gate. That's how space gate. That's how it felt. Yeah. Oh, that's how it felt. Yep. That's what I said. Space. And gate. that's why you're like anal. I switched, but that's and then how, my then, anus and then, was the space then, gate yeah, too. Yeah, I was like, which one? I I can't even win. There's no tightness anywhere. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, you're great. jokes. You're great. You never answered how many times you would like to fuck in a day. <clears throat> yeah, I'd say twice. Oh, really? Yeah, twice. Sex for me is good. Jerking off, no good. I know, but twice you would want to have sex in a day. If I'm like what home. hours? For me, like I feel like twice. I'm most horny usually at like three o'clock. That's what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. Is that That's normal? That's what I'm fucking that, saying. 
in. Yes, that's prime time. Mid-day. That's crazy. That that maybe that's for everybody. Our midday sex just hits different. I'm even down for noon. It's not that I like right have, before my workout. I, I really don't have sex yes. at that time ever, to be honest. But I just know that like usually around that time, for some reason, I get horny thoughts. I know it's fucked. I did something crazy the other day. Speaking of three o'clock horny. What? Ass. I saw my neighbor walking her dog and she was hot and I had to go jerk off. <laughs> just just you looking saw out her. the window. Were you jerking was, off to her? No. You were looking out the window? Oh, <laughs> no, shit. No. Have you guys seen American Horror Stories? That happens right in the really? beginning. Yeah. I didn't know. Yeah. I had to run upstairs. I said, oh God, I had to jerk off. This baby. So yeah, that's, yeah, that's going to get me horny. You're just seeing somebody outside. That's not good. That's wild. That's bad. She must be very hot. It's more of a neighbor fantasy thing. Oh, it's like it's like my granny thing. That thing doing things? No, no, oh, no, 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 no. It's good. She's just. She's I think just it's your sleeping. turn to ask us oh, a yes. question. Oh yes. Um, ask us a question that you had for us. Y'all, I didn't would not prepare. You could have told me about this beforehand. Okay. I did I, actually, yeah. believe it or not. You, well, like beforehand, but I wasn't. She thinking. doesn't for. She really she, doesn't remember. No, no, no. Shit, no. It's not that she doesn't remember anything. She remembers, but she manipulates. You think she's acting like she didn't hear that when you oh. literally said to her, yo, oh. you're going to have to ask this question. You don't I, for- I forgot to think about a question. That's better. Okay, okay. remember how you said ADHD doesn't exist? Have you learned <laughs> anything from this whole trip? Yeah, women are liars. I have ADHD very bad, and I think that it is noticeable for a lot of people. But You have ADHD too? Yeah, I Same do too. Here. Why, why can't I have it as well? You I don't understand. You literally fucking knock me having ADHD all the time. But if we all have it, then all nine, everybody has it. I do think that the reason I think that the reason it's so common nowadays is actually um, because of how we grew up. I think there's multiple factors. I think uh, it's like, first of all, technology and how we intake information. I think there's a lot of sugar in like and process things that fuck up your attention span. Um, but I, yeah, I think it's mostly how we intake information in general. Mm-hmm. So I think it's, is uh, like more people are having ADHD. Um, so, but I do think it's a real thing. Absolutely. Same. Absolutely. Uh, shut your fucking mouth. I absolutely uh. think it is. I have it, I have it too. I have it every day. So what's your question? Yeah. Is it oh yeah. Sorry. Um, ADHD. it's ADHD, man. Yeah. It happens all the time. Um, you gotta be careful. I mean, I think that the reason this podcast is how it is, is usually because of the ADHD. Yeah. Monkey mind. An untrained goes mind. I agree. We should just change the podcast into ADHD. ADHD, attention yeah. deficit disorder. Right. There's probably already one out there. That's like, definitely, true. definitely. You know how people part, just they they cook on that marketing. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. They love it. That's I mean, why I don't like it. It's like the woman for woman thing that we talked about earlier. Yeah. You just say something's for okay. ADHD people and they love it. Sorry, I was it's giving you go. time. Yeah. Go. go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. Oh wait, she didn't have it. She's gone. She lost. ADHD. No, 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 no. Okay, 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 okay. Stage D. What's a wild kink that you that you want to tell somebody or you want to say to your partner or partners, but you're like, this is so intense. Like, I don't know if they would be down, but you just, you don't even know if you like it. You just want to try it. It's hard because I feel like I'm pretty honest with that stuff, but let me think. Let me just dig deep. Hey, let me think too. I don't. Uh, hold on. Are you saying this because it's our last night? <laughs> oh, no. that's pretty good, bro. That's you genius. can, yo, you could say anything right now. And I know she has to do it. She has to do it. It what? will go down. Why do I have to do it? I you rank. don't have to. No, but you kink. will. Yeah, you can do it. Well, you don't. You don't have to. Want to? Are you saying your kink is the rape kink? You already well, expressed that. That's what I'm saying. Let me think of something better. Yeah. Okay, but time out. When we say a kink, right? Is it just mean like? I never understood this in the sense of like, is it kink could be anything? It could be like, oh, I like fucking girls with red socks on or like I like fucking grandmas yep. or like, mm-hmm. so it could be like a type of person too. It doesn't have to be like in the bedroom. Oh, I like when you fucking yeah, throw that's, your thumb in my ass. If, if it's a type of person, I feel like that's a little different because it wouldn't be like a partner. I wouldn't be afraid. It would be like a partner I was trying to go after. Right. But it could be either you're saying you don't care. Mm-hmm. Okay. Shit. <laughs> this was a good question. Well, it's just hard because, again, I feel like I'm pretty open with the people I date about, like, what I'm into. Okay, well, so, Jay, then what's your kink? I mean, feet is, like, probably one of my top kinks. What? Do you like sucking on feet? Sucking, 
I like the look of feet mostly. Sucking, I'll suck on a feet, but it, on a feet, on a feet, I will suck on, on, suck on a feet. feet. Um, I like toe jobs, so I more like that. Well, um, is that weird? And I also What's like toe job? my ass eight. Okay, toe job. This is this is what I was talking about. Is that not every girl can do this because like their feet not might not be mm. able to do it. But if there is separation between the big toe and the other toe, you can put the dick in there and just <coughs> while I'm eating her out. Oh shit. It's very, I only had it with one girl before, but it was like probably the most pleasure I've experienced. One of the most pleasure. I totally know what you're talking about. Yeah. Well, I'm eating her. <laughs> like, I totally know what you're talking about. Oh, is that top two? Maybe you should try it out today. Maybe that a, yeah. like you're chode. It probably wouldn't work. Yeah, no. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay. Uh, I don't know. I don't really have like a. There's nothing that you've been like, I kind of want to try that. Well, the problem is I don't I don't watch sex. But like, it's not you don't have to watch it. You just like have to feel it. Like that's what I want. Like, what do you like? What is deep in? Like that's what I'm saying. Ass eating, I'm down for it. But I yeah. also, but like, is that really weird? No, because it's no. number one ass eating in the pot in the world. So. This is the number one ass eating podcast. Yeah. So that's what I'm saying. Maybe so you should I, like, eat his ass tonight. I literally asked you to do that yesterday, and you said no. She, uh, yeah, she just kind of ignored me. Yeah, because we weren't in a sexual moment. Oh, you were just like, yo, eat my ass. Yeah. You said eat my ass today. That's not bad. I think that that's, that's how you have to bring it up, though, as a guy. You know, in the sexual moment, it feels a little too vulnerable. Whereas, like, if you make it as a joke just to lay to the groundwork, being like, yeah, I'm kind of in it. That's what yeah. people do with tink kinks anyways, is that, like, if they are embarrassed to, like, be in the moment and be like, yo, I really like this, they'll just joke about it to, like, let somebody know, hey, I'm kind of in it into this but like okay i don't really I know see that so except for like when you piss me off or something i'm like fucking suck my ass or eat my ass and then walk out okay that's a little i i, I think how did is that how you said it eat my ass like in a response to no, something no i literally said yo fucking eat my ass yeah but it was in like con uh, not in conjunction but it was in a sentence where you were being sarcastic already no you but, took it as sarcasm but see, you want me difference. to eat your ass on all fours <laughs> yeah yeah why is that? Is that funny? Is that no. weird? Is that funny to you? That's not weird. That the is sexologist is finding the sex funny. Sex is so funny. That's why I love it. Okay, I figured out what mine is. What okay. is it? It's very specific. Okay. I mean, mine was pretty specific. Mine is weird. It's a, mine was strange, so it's okay. This is a this safe, is space? safe space. Yes. I want you to jerk me off from behind. I'm into that too. While she's eating your ass. I, I didn't have that part added. But now I want it. But now I'm down. But yeah, you could, yeah, do that. I kind of want to feel like you're cuddling me and then jerking me off from behind. I do like that sometimes. And you've talked about that on this podcast that you're have into I? that. Yeah, you, you have said that you like that. Like, girl from behind, yeah. Like, I like that sometimes in the mornings where, like, you're sleeping and you're on your side and then she'll come up behind you and start fucking You jacking. did that this morning. Did I? A tiny bit. A tiny bit. I do like getting woken up with like head or anything like touch my dick when I'm asleep. It's kind of weird though. Cause like I wouldn't do anything to a girl while she's asleep, but like I low key want a girl to do something to me while I'm asleep. I kind of did that to you today. I like that. I'm, I really like that. Oh, well, I know. The best thing is, I you're just a ball of horny, so I know if I just do anything sexual, you're down. I'm good to go. Well, go follow her, um, <laughs> you know, and uh, subscribe to our podcast. This is very low energy, huh? Yeah. Subscribe, rate, suck a dick. Oh, that's good. All right, you suck go Suck a dick ahead. or get hit. That was fucking professional. Yeah. We're not good. We need to get no. better. Like that yeah. was crazy. Give turn me, on, give me, give me, give me, give me a month and a half. I need a, I need a refractory period. <laughs> <laughs>